Parental discretion is advised. Five, four, three. Merry fucking Christmas, hot dogs. This is DJ Lunchbox, and I have a tiny puppy trying to crawl its way into my mouth. It is the annual Mayhem Christmas Spectacular. Holy fuck, guys. This is going to be a good one. I'm well into a bottle of delicious apple wine. That's right, apple wine. Is it made from apples? It's made from apples and cider and spice. Uh, <laughs> I meant to say it's delicious alcohol. It's, it's, I didn't know it was a thing until I started putting it in my mouth. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm your host for the evening, DJ Lunchbox. You can find me at DJ Lunchbox on Twitter, and you know me from the Wrestling Mayhem Show, which you're watching right now. Well done, and Merry Christmas. <laughs> to my right, here on the couch, the fucking... The, God damn it, he's brave, because he's here on the couch with me two years in a row. I'm going to feed him this wine bottle. Ladies and gentlemen, the Riz. He didn't say where. <laughs> I'm, I'm scared to know where these, where that bottle is going. It's butthole. okay. It'll be empty. Uh, <laughs> is it? Does it? Where? Where would? Does it start with the? It's gonna be a surprise, okay. folks. <laughs> behind the boards is the man himself, the master of ceremonies, ladies and gentlemen, Sargatron. I'm drinking. Sargatron's and, drinking, and I'm wearing my Christmas shirt. Hey, there it is. Hey, what's up, Juggalos? And drop my phone. Oh no. Oh. I dropped my phone. Hey, hey, you know what we got? Hi. We got, I did, I did some, I, 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 we have some cameras, right? We have cameras? And I found this one over here. Look at that! What? Look at that! Boom! What is that? What's up? It's a hard camera swirl. Dog I've been there the whole time! Dog hand. Dog hand. Dog, dog hand. hand. Dog hand Christmas. Audio, audio listeners, sorry. I made a dog hand. It's a dog hand. Also on the show this week, ladies and gentlemen, we have a bevy of whores. No, that's not right. Uh, a bevy no, of that's, hosts. That, that's kind of right. Huh? Wrestle fans. Four. My tits for a buck oh five. <laughs> <laughs> that voice, that underage voice, we disavow all knowledge. Ladies and gentlemen, the Wrestle fan. Ah, no, I'm kidding. I, I only show my tits for certain others. Uh, hello, it's the Christmas episode. The drink I'm partaking in is some Tylenol cold and multi-symptom. Chug it. And it makes me fucking crazy. Chug so it. let's do this. That's chug, fantastic. Chug, 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 Ladies chug. and gentlemen. Okay. Wait, hold oh. on. Hold on. He's well, going to do it. He's, he's going to do, do it. He's going to be asleep by the know. second segment. This is going to be a horrible idea. Do no, it, man. This is going to be the best I, idea. Don't do listen to me. Listen. You. I'm serious. Do you. Don't chug right? all of it. Do not. Yeah, don't. Don't. Seriously. Do we're serious. Do don't chug all of it. We don't know where we are, so we can send him help. At the trap. We're going to say, go to Texas and save him. No! That's good. You're good. good. All right, that's it. Don't no, no, say any more. You'll be asleep in ten minutes. You'll damage your kidneys and we'll have no indie minutes. <laughs> Folks, <laughs> every now, <laughs> every now and then, we have someone on the show so 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 powerful, so imposing. He holds the Infinity Gauntlet with all the Infinity Gems. He runs Pittsburgh, ladies and gentlemen, making his grand return to the show, fucking Jim Shireman. Holy shit. Hey, everybody. I can't believe you would have me back on this show on one hand. On the other hand, I can totally understand that because I'm kind of awesome and whatnot. Uh, and I'm very old. I'm drinking water because I'm very, very old, and it's way past my bedtime. So this is just sort of, sort of a cleansing uh, kind of thing. For Welcome me. to the Big Boys Club. <laughs> Thank you. Which I also ate dinner at four o'clock at Kings, like a. Fun <laughs> <laughs> was that, I don't even was know that what, early but, enough but, to but get the early bird special? Do they have early oh, bird the special there at Kings? No. I was a little low. Did you, did you get the early bird special? <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> Fantastic, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Okay, yes. good stuff, good stuff. Now, um, we have we have another return to the show. Another one? That's fucking right, another one. <laughs> He's been gone, but not forgotten. He's joined us digitally each and every week from his uh, personal Mad Mike cave in the Bronx. But he's back, live on the fucking Mayhem Show! Mad Mike is back! 
Yay! <laughs> hey guys, it's Matt and Mike once again with your minute of no. no wait, wait, no, 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 no wrong no, segment. That's all right. Hi, what's up, bitches? There it is. Wrong Hi. segment. Uh, I'm I'm actually here and I'm full of lights and full of Santa <laughs> and I'm the only one wearing a Santa hat. You fucking Grinchy Scrooge! Well, 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 well. You are wait, not wait, the wait, only wait. one wearing a Santa hat. I want to tell you. Ultimate X the Owl. That's right. Is a festive owl. <laughs> Woo! Festive well, feather. Does he friend. have his own little bar across the screen there, Sorgatron? Well, no, because he's just kind of hanging out with. And me. I'm the only <laughs> he's not a real a person. Listen, listen. When you got beat up with a baseball bat and you had, uh, and you've been taxidermied. And speared. And speared. And speared. He was speared. He was time. speared. DJ Lunchbox. No, it wasn't by me. It was no, no. Edge. no. Was I mean, edge. you know it about being taxidermied. I do know about being taxidermied. Exactly. I spent I spent three years uh, in college taxidermied, and I tell you what, I wouldn't change. I wouldn't trade it for anything. It was the best years of my life. I thought he was. I thought he was just used to getting stuffed. That too. I yeah. love getting. And whose voice was that? Whose I don't voice know. Was that? Jesus Christ! There's. <laughs> Even more people, oh, ladies and gentlemen. Fucking, going on. Here we are in the hangout. As you can Who's see, that? if you're watching Google Hangout, we've got first up is Wheels, Hot Wheels. Hey, hi everybody, I'm back. Fantastic, ladies and gentlemen, Hot Bobby F. J. Town in the hangout. Merry Christmas. Yay. El Grand Azul, all the way from New Mexico. The other one. There oh, we are. Yeah. 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 Hey. We another. Hey. Hold on. We've got. Okay, now that's. The end of who I know who it is. Uh, <laughs> is uh, Zero. Zero 2K, ladies and gentlemen. From the wrestlingrevolution.com. I'm, I'm hurt. Oh. Zero 2K, 2K looks a lot like Ultimate Spider. <laughs> <laughs> who's, that, who's that person on the end? Yeah, on the end? On the end? Sorg. That's Sorg. That's, That's me. Sorg, right ladies right and gentlemen. Joining us in the chat, the man himself, the master of ceremonies, is Sorgatron. But, 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 but no, no, you don't worry about it because I'm here. Hi, Sorg. Hi, Sorg. I'm here. Uh, and then I'm here. Uh, it's Sorg. And then wait. I'm here. There's Sorg. Sorgatron. <laughs> and there's a dog. Dog in. Dog in. Dog in. <laughs> All right. This is goddamn ridiculous. Let's 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 start things properly. How was that again? Huh? I don't know. How's that again? Let's 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 kick things off the the right way to do it. The same way we do it every single year, all day, every day, uh, with a little bit of fan mail. Don't we have to plug have things one? first? One. Oh, we have oh, one. It's in your Jesus favorite. Christ. We have one fan mail and it's mine. I'm no, 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 no. You're you just do saying... the other thing before that. Oh my God! I don't. I don't remember all. Uh, check us out on uh, wrestlingmailshow.com. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you can subscribe to us on iTunes, on Stitcher, on Spreaker, on Blip TV. Uh, view us on your Roku. Look at us on on your YouTube. I think you can actually see us on Apple TV, if I'm not mistaken. If you want to talk to oh, us, hey. and God knows you do want to talk to us, you can hit us up at get at wrestlingmayhemshow.com, or you can give us a call 412-206-WMSO, aka nine six. Seven zero, hit us up, buy the app, uh, view the gold. Uh, I put my penis in a secret place on this week's gold. What? Uh, <laughs> I'm confirmed. I'm confirmed. Secret. <laughs> it's, it's, like it's like a weird fucked up game of Where's Waldo. It is. It's a, <laughs> if you spot it, tell us where. Um, Email the show at it's. <laughs> <laughs> You're just drunk with power. <laughs> Hey, By the I app. only get it on here once a year. Fair enough. Fair I enough. only get to sit on the couch once a year. Okay. I get to say that once. Well, then what is, what is the once. app? Where, where can you get the app? You can get the app right here on your iPhone. I'm oh. going to pull it up right now. We've both got iPhones. I know. we both got iPhones. It's also on Google. Oh is it Google Play? Google Play. Please, no, nope. no. Nope. Um, Amazon. Amazon. Amazon App Store. Amazon Amazon app store. What's, your, what's your lock paper, your wallpaper? It's just regular. Mine's a target. Guys, guys show. Know. Guys show. Mine's guys show. Show. Phil, what? Phil, what? Phil. <laughs> there's, there's the app right here. The app. point is, the, right here. the point <laughs> is, you can get a hold of us. We want you to get a hold of us. We want to talk to you. We want to know what you like. And now here is LB's personal phone number. Uh, five five five. Whoa. <laughs> Eight six seven five three zero. Oh, Let me ask you a question. You know how they always say it's Klondike Five? Was Klondike really a phone thing in the past? You ever watch old movies? Yeah. 
What? I don't know what you're talking about. And I did just watch Die Hard 2, thank you very much. What is this have it's to not do that with that Charlie Chaplin on these movies? There's like two people in their 60s who are going to know what I'm talking about. Anyway. <laughs> yes, that's our demographic. Hey, anyway, anyway, we want to know what you like on. about the Wrestling Mayhem show. We also want to know what you don't like so we can make fun of you for it. <laughs> if you don't like us, me, then fuck you. That's right. I love the 20s. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, remember the Great Depression? <laughs> I remember. LB, LB, I remember when. You remember when? <laughs> Are we doing it? We're doing, doing it, it now. now. <laughs> God, that would have. Why didn't we set that up? That would have been great. That would have been great. Get great Depression, you know, more like Great, great Impression. Am I right? Am I right? Andy Dick, right? Andy Dick's on that show. <laughs> Wrestling Man okay. show brought to you by Little Orphan Annie. <laughs> And we're going to drink more of the by Bonds. By Bonds. <laughs> and, uh, okay. So, uh, anyway, the point of all that is we want you to talk. Yes. Yeah, we want you to talk to us, and uh, we want you to email us specifically at. <laughs> at WrestlingMayhemShow.com. And it's also it's, right oops. on the app as well. You can email us right through the right app. Through the app. We've done the work passing the savings on to you. Mm. Um, Call the show right on the app. That's right. Uh, anyway, so the point is uh, fan mail. Fan mail. We're going to move right into fan mail. Do we got, sure. How many do we got? I don't know. Well, I know I've got one. I got I to gotta hang out. I can't bring up my phone. Okay. Do we have any more? Uh, wrestle, wrestle fan? fan, do your job. Do we have any more? Yeah. What, I, uh, uh, we have two. We have two? We have two from what I know. And a voicemail, I think. And, and I'm, I'm sure AJ has to chime in. Ugh. Okay. Well, this is fun. Uh... Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and, and start in with this email. There is a picture involved. There's a picture involved. Sort. Do you know about this? Do you know about this picture? Oh yeah. Do you have music? Which one is it? It's, oh, oh, it's a it's a music one. Okay, hold on a second. Sorks Sorks, cue it up. It. We're gonna pull up the music, and uh, we'll be with you shortly. I'm gonna sit here and drink more wine. As, <laughs> look at look at Wrestle Fan while I drink more wine. Oh, holy crap! That's a good one. Right back after these messages. Hi, <sighs> puppy. Right? Fuck, that's good. All right. Hey. <laughs> Hey, 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 it's me, it's me, it's Big Bippy C. Oh, I should do it like that all the time. That was good. That was, that was pretty brilliant. You should do it drunk more. Do drunk all the time. Yeah, I think, I think the wine is the secret. That would go over real well, it works. Balls. <laughs> <laughs> Only got to see parts of Raw because of other bills are more important than my cable bill, so I need to watch it on web. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> so something about Slammies this week, I think. When can we do wrestling mayhem show Slammies? Mayhem. We can pick what we think would be superstar of the year, match of the year, food of the year, jobber of the year, act. Food? Food of the year? Food of the year, <laughs> act. Food of the year. <laughs> so, DNA had the pay per view this past weekend. <laughs> It was too bad. <laughs> I, I, I enjoyed the tag. It was too bad. It was too bad. I enjoyed the tag title match with Chavo and Hernandez versus whoever was good. Uh, <laughs> Samoa Joe I lost. I believe that would be the the um, Morgan and the Organ. Uh, oh. <laughs> Samoa <Some, some laughs> Joe lost to Kat Von D. Ugh. Really? Von D. Damn it! RVD beat Ken King in good match. AJ versus Daniels was good for 29,000 times. <laughs> but last one. What the fuck ever? <laughs> Knockouts happened, that is it. I like Victoria, but I didn't even watch it instead. I went and took shit. <laughs> <laughs> Kaz wrestled someone It was pretty good <laughs> Angle's team against Aces and Ed's team should have been good But it was barely passable Bully Ray versus Eris was pretty good Eris stales to win 
wish the Hogans would go fuck off. <laughs> Bro, go fuck yourself. Hulk, go fuck yourself. We, we don't video. need to have Hogans every fucking start line. Ugh. Funny pic from PWI 500 magazine below explains it. <laughs> and uh, for you live listeners now, you're uh, watching me drink wine. <laughs> The uh, picture is a cartoon of Dixie Carter. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna go it's, on. They can they can see it. It says uh, Dixie Carter. Isn't she one of the designing women? And it says not a few past months of impact or anything to buy. She isn't. And Dixie's holding up a sign that says hire Hebner's kid, hire Bischoff's kid, hire Devon's kids, hire Hogan's kids. And at the bottom says check if Hall and Nash have kids. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so, looking forward to WWE TLC. I am looking forward to TLC with Ryback and Team Helno versus The Shield Reigns, Rollins and Ambrose. Chairs match with Sheamus and Shaw should be good. Ziggler versus Cena in ladder match uh, should steal the show. Table match? We will uh, see. The table match is going to be uh, Team Car Stereo versus um, Road Scholars. Is title truth for sus- but is t- <clears throat> again. Is t- <laughs> sorry, sorry, keep on. Hey, 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 hey. hey. Oh. It's <laughs> uh, uh, is title truth versus Cesaro should be good Cesaro for the win, I hope. Coffee versus Barrett, I like both, but more partial to Barrett. I would like to have Barrett be a part of the world <laughs> title, but the championship is a championship, I guess. Punk is the man looking forward to him versus The Rock. <clears throat> so, question of the week. Who do you guys think will win Royal Rumble this year? I say either way, Barrett is my heel pick, as my face pick, unfortunately, Cena, I guess. <clears throat> and what would be the match at Mania? Barrett versus Sheamus would be good. <laughs> Cena versus Punk or Rock is the best pick. <laughs> Who is your breakout superstar of the year? I say either Sandar or Cesaro. Please answer with the others on the show. Till next time, it's me, it's me, it's Big PPC. No, 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 no. It's Big PPC. <laughs> Great job, by the way, fellas. Take it easy. Mayhem. One more line. Oh, uh, sent from my iPhone. <laughs> <laughs> That was the best impression I think I've ever heard from you. That was, was amazing. Yeah. It wasn't amazing. all choppy. Is that? It wasn't all choppy. You were actually like kind of moving uh, in a pretty good... Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Drinking wine. Full that 25 was, frames a second. Awesome. That was lovely. So, the question of the night is... Is? The question. first one. Who <laughs> is going to win that Royal Rumble? My favorite pay-per-view of the year. Who's going to win it? What's your second favorite? Uh, eh, WrestleMania probably okay, pretty okay. good. I'm all a right. fan of that. Yeah. I like TLC or Hell in the Cell when they go all out. Yeah, that's like, not been happening lately. No. no. <laughs> the last time they did that in Hell in the Cell that I remember was uh, Batista versus Triple H. The oh, blow off to that. Yes. Fuck, oh, oh, that was great. Yes, yes, but that wasn't that pay per view. Like I think they just, they, it was before they had. The, the yeah, before right? that. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, Sorg. What was the question? Who gonna win that pay? <laughs> who gonna win that Royal Rumble? Who gonna win that? <laughs> gonna win that? Who gonna win that who WrestleMania? Gonna win that? Uh, what? No, that's not right either. Um, who wins the Rumble? Who wins the Rumble? Jeez, jeez, jeez. Somebody new. Let's get somebody new. Let's get somebody fresh. Dolph Ziggler's already got his money in the bank coming on over here. Uh, we got uh, who? Who else is on the rise? Who else is on the rise? Nobody. Will yeah. Barrett. No. Jamie Ooh. Sandow. Antonio Cesaro. No, no. Okay, I'll tell you what. Antonio. Sandow's too early. I want to say I'm going with Barrett. I like Barrett. And I'm, the, the, I'm thinking about it. that's the only guy I think I can think of that's like at that level. Like I can't see a Cody Rhodes doing it. Uh, definitely not a Zack Ryder unless like something turns around on him. Oh my god! <laughs> I think the reason why you just said Zack Ryder is because huh? Chachi is nowhere to be found. Chachi's nowhere to be found. We haven't addressed that. You know, Chachi's not here. I know. Wait, you may have noticed not? the lack of negativity, but Chachi's not here. Sitting in his seat. <laughs> yeah. Yes, Sid, you are Sid in Chachi's seat. <laughs> It's okay. He's locked up in the basement. We are in the basement. <laughs> I didn't say what basement. Shh, embrace it. Shh. It's okay. Shh. It's just gonna get worse. Um, but no, no. Like, yeah, Barrett, Barrett's got to be like the only guy I can think of that's going to that next level. They could do something with. They could. That's true. They could. I mean, really. 
They could do something boring and pull a Randy Orton. I could see that happening. Oh. And oh. Bobby just shit the Everybody's road. angry. That's what my pick is going to be Bob. because he always wins. He's going to win out of nowhere. Out of nowhere. nowhere. Out out of nowhere. nowhere. Oh, this, this, this is actually something I wanted to talk about real quick here with, with Randy Orton. I, I think they're very afraid to push Randy Orton because they're so, they're so scared. He's so close to being off here with a third strike against the wellness policy. I think they're petrified to push him and have him do something stupid and then be left with their nuts hanging out. I mean, mm-hmm. he'll just, I, I hit, he'll just think, hit an RKO think... on the uh, drug tester and it'll be okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, I see what saying, though. I mean, like, because he's always fucking with the sort of mid Carter talents. Like, he's always feuding with Alberto Del Rio or, like, fucking Cody or something. Sure. Like, Take I, I, I think they are legitimately worried that if they give him too much, you know, it'll, it'll uh, go back in their faces. Yeah, I mean, you, you keep hearing about these, these this push that he's going he's gonna to go till, uh, turn heel again, and he's going to get this big push, and it never comes, and it never comes. Why does it never come? They're, I, I just think they're, I think they're very That's cons- what she said. Yeah, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I think, the same, I think they're the same way with Rey Mysterio. Yeah. Because Rey Mysterio is on the third strike thing, too, and... Oh, plus he's he's one you know tiny little injury away from retire, just walking away. Well, I, I think they just want to try and preserve Mysterio and Sin Cara to have the match between them at WrestleMania. So they I think get, it's like, definitely true. Mysterio also dresses like a marshmallow peep. <laughs> so, uh, Dal- so uh, Sherman, who, but I I agree with you on that. But who do you think will has a good chance of winning the win in the Rumble? <sighs> I think Wade Barrett is probably the pick if you go with an up-and-comer. Um, you know, I think they'll probably fuck us and make it, you know, it'll be Cena or, or <laughs> you know, some bullshit pick. You would, I would love to see Sandow win. That would be excellent. That would um, be great. But mm-hmm. I think we're giving creative a little too much credit by, by making that <laughs> pick, uh, you know. I think if you're going to have – Barrett appears to have the push at this moment, you know, will that carry through to what – when is that pay-per-view in January? Um, yeah, I don't know, but uh, you know, I, I I think Barrett is probably the pick. Yeah, so mm-hmm. wrestle fan, what do you think? Uh, I'm gonna Great say Ces- <laughs> I'm sorry. Good answer. Go ahead. Uh, uh, I'm gonna say Cesaro. Uh, he has pretty much been the money point of every RAW. Like he literally has not like I don't think ever done a bad match like in, to my memory, um, and I could see Barrett, but in my I, in my opinion Barrett sort of like plateaued. I think uh, he came back like he came back really strong, but now he's sort of like sort of in a, like a holding pattern where like there's that much for him right now. But yeah, he's got the IC title match with Kofi, but still like a throwaway <laughs> match. Um, so I definitely see Cesaro. I, I see them giving it to him, even if he doesn't win at Mania. He doesn't have to win the title at Mania. But, you know, giving him that Royal Rumble win, I think, could propel him. Cool. Uh, Mad Mike, what do you think? Um, the safe pick for me is Cena. Yeah. But, yeah, I know. But, I mean, you know, <laughs> if you want Cena rock, that's pretty much the way to do it. But, if, yeah. I mean, my wish, I'd love to see... A surprise Jericho come back and have Jericho Ziggler at Mania. Yeah, that mm-hmm. would be good. Mm-hmm. I get into that. Uh, Google Hangout, what do you think? Wait, hold on. Just the fucking Riz that I ask you? No. Riz! I feel, I feel <laughs> Who's going to win? Who's going to win, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> who's gonna... <laughs> who's, who's your good buddy, Riz? Who's going to win the Rumble? Who's a good Riz? The great Cully. He's gonna come out of nowhere and oh, win it. Okay, hold on. Let's talk about this. No. Riz has got like a Riz has got like a huge ass boner for the Great Khali, and I don't know why. Okay, <gasps> like every every time this every time he brutal. there's a question about anything, it's always the Great Khali. Isn't he not the best wrestler? Uh, he's the he's, biggest. he's certainly yeah. the biggest. Yeah, he's great at he's he's great at pork and Vicky Guerrero. If you watched Raw last night. <laughs> yeah, put it in her five hole. <laughs> All right, <laughs> on to the chat. Um, not the Lunchbox. chat. Did you give your answer? I, did I pick? I don't think you did. No. You picked. No, you didn't pick. Uh, I, I agree, Barrett. I think Barrett's a great pick uh, if they want to give someone a push. If they don't give want to give someone a push, I think they give it to The Miz. 
Uh, I think they're enjoying his business lately. I think I think I could see Miz. He's on an upswing. Yeah, I mean, he's, he's on one that, of those. For sure. I mean, because yeah, totally. that's what they do is they make something. That's what always happens with wrestling. I mean, he's really high. He goes all the way up to WrestleMania and they cool him off for a bit, right? Mm-hmm. He's in, been in the cool off. The cool off. Now they're turning him face. I think it's working really well. Some people are annoyed by it, but still, uh, he's selling T-shirts, yeah. right? Mm-hmm. right? Oh, that's no, he was sell, and he was selling that's T-shirts me. before, and I don't doubt he's. Selling and that's t-shirts. why he's a face, so he can sell even more T-shirts, right? So oh, my, that's great. Uh, but he's still horrible. <laughs> He's really bad. I think no, he's, no, he's no, 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 no. I think he's fine. you're the only no, one with that he's opinion. The, only one the, Miz, that opinion. the Miz is a face is 100% the same as Miz is a heel he's just talking to different people yeah, yeah okay. that's it that's it now now we get to see him react with the Damien Sandow and Cody Rhodes with the creepy mustache oh that mustache oh that was we are great. gonna get into that mustache oh, man. we are gonna get into it I wanna ask I wanna ask the Google Hangout what, guys uh, let's start bring that up okay uh, uh, Jesus where would all the the masked people go <laughs> um, okay we're gonna we're gonna go down the line as I see it Alexander Cars quick who's gonna win the Royal Rumble Colt Cabana. Colt Cabana. Oh, Colt Cabana. <laughs> Zero. Oh, that's the Jew horse. <laughs> Jew horse. Uh, <laughs> Brian. Happy. But I think it's gonna go to Ryback. Ryback. Uh, Ryback. Oh. Yes, that is a possibility we've all overlooked. Uh, How about Brock Lesnar? That's totally doable. Uh, Bobby. Bobby FJ time. Hey, Who do you Mike. Think? Uh, I got two. I got two picks. One safe pick and one surprise pick. Mad Mike kind of spoiled my surprise pick. Uh, so I go with that one first. Brock Lesnar. Would be my surprise pick. Right, um, the other one, the safe pick, Alberto Del Rio. That's a good one. Again. Ooh. Right I'm good. I'm Wheels. good. Wheels, what do you think? My pick, honestly, I hate to say in probably theory it would be Ryback, but my my guess and hope would be Cesaro. Mm. Come on, I think it's too early for Cesaro, though. That's yeah. what I think. I, that's I, my I, only I concern. I'd like to see Cesaro. Yeah. But I disagree. Third, third I, dimension I sword. Who is it? Third dimension sword. Third dimi- Hang on. Uh, yes, yes. I would like to see Barrett Wade. <laughs> <laughs> I love third dimension sword. That's fantastic. Dwayne Wade. Great success. Dwayne Wade. Whoa. Okay. Whoa. Hey. <laughs> All right. So, uh, second email. What was, what was second point? email. Who's got it? Who's got it? Sarah, read great. the second email. Wait, <laughs> no, Lady Lunchbox is here. She doesn't have a microphone. Yeah, Lady Lunchbox is, is here. Wave to, yeah, wait, 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 to wave to the camera. Yeah, wait. There you go. There. Hi. There. Hi. Hi. It's her okay. hand. Make a Hi. make a dog hand. They love that. They like the dog <laughs> hand. Dog <laughs> hand. Apparently, <laughs> she made a bunny. <laughs> she made a bunny. That's for Texas Anarchy. Okay. Um. So there's another email. I suppose there is. There is. Do you want me to do it? Am I? Can I do Bo Diggity? Is this? Oh. God. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do it. Chachi's, Chachi's gonna shit his shit right. blood. He's gonna shit I blood. Bet, I bet he is. Woo! Ty Warner and the Carolinas want me to care about TNA. Uh, TW Carolinas, and I, and I guess it's the listing. Carolinas at TWC Carolinas, uh, December 9th, 2012, 1 30 p.m. As TNA's wrestling's 10th year draws to a close, watch TNA Final Resolution live tonight at 7.30 p.m. TWC on demand.com slash event slash default dot dot dot. Bo F. Diggity. The F is for firm. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, that was the best impression of a, a homeless uh, oil tycoon I've ever heard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, I would like to personally apologize to Bo Diggity. For that impression of him, apologize, Mr. Fan. Personally, apologize. Personally, handing him an apologize. The only one close into the South to fucking match that woo. Okay, apologize. So you got the woo. I you got the woo. Every state has a South wrestle. Tiny Poppy. Sorg, uh, do we have any voicemail? I believe we have a voicemail, sir. I Let's go right to it. That's fire. Yeah, voicemail. Can I read the translation? Okay. <laughs> See, that's how you do it. Right fire. Fire. That's how. <laughs> that's how you do it. Oh, fucking diggity! <laughs> Greetings, dear ear holes. Said my penis. <laughs> two in the morning. I have not really slept in two days. Oh Just no! Yeah, true story. Out. Also, pregnancy is weird. <laughs> pregnancy is Merry weird. Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Kwanzaa to my black friend. DJ Lunchbox, and also Wheels. <laughs> <laughs> Black as well. Lunchbox, white chocolate, though. 
That's just that's just how that is. <laughs> He's not wrong. Uh, I just want to wish Merry Christmas to the Mayhem crew. <laughs> <laughs> two in the morning. I, I'm driving and I I've lost control really of words. The space time continuum escapes me periodically. <laughs> this doesn't have anything to do with wrestling. No. Oh. Sleep deprived. And my hand doesn't fit down my pants anymore because my belt's too tight. What? <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's just my butter. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> I'm king of the episode. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mad Mike. Mad Mike, I apologize, but that may be the best Christmas song we've ever had on the Mayhem show. I think, I think I it's deserved at that point. <laughs> Wrestle fan as Grandmaster of the Mayhemies, mark the time, mark the date, mark the episode number. I am nominating that voicemail for voicemail of the year. We didn't have that category Second. before, but it's all right. Second. New category. Moving New category. On, on, on and number. winner. Don't even bother with the rest. That's right. There you go. There you go. It's in the back. We'll send you Congratulations your Congratulations on your mayhemy bow diggity. <laughs> exactly right. Folks, that's it. <laughs> that's it. You got nothing else? That's, that's it. it. That's that's it. This has been a great mayhem show. No, 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 no. We got more. We got <laughs> more. <laughs> Sorry, he sent in two voicemails. That wasn't the one I was Oh, that wasn't there's the one? Two? There's, there's, another there's another one? one? Holy shit. Yeah. I was oh, going to read the damn. translation. Make sure it <laughs> says the first voicemail. <laughs> I don't know. It doesn't say anything. Play it. I'm working on it. Uh, Matt and Mike, go ahead and read the translation. All right. And this is also from Bo Diggity, just FYI. Um, oh, okay. Ciao. Oh, Merry Chris. This is both your walker. Good evening, gentlemen. I know it's Chris a showtime. I know I've already made one voicemail this week, and I was going to sleep deprive, stay for my mom, was in the right place. <laughs> Some to translate slash it. I was real tired. I felt like, yeah, like. So there you go. Translation week. Merry Christmas. <laughs> and what's wrong? But I didn't read about it. Sounds like you, Ms. And I'm done. Not Chris is. Have a good time to drive. Have a designated driver. Book that you want to be Mother Chase. Looking forward to hear is about his his about what I'm going crazy, but also safety on safety, personal safety, vehicle safety, as well as for the most part. So, borrow the <laughs> Stel Getty, yes, Stel Getty, some flight plan. Well, I wouldn't be oh, surprised yeah. if that's actually in the voicemail. That is in there. I, I, I wonder how that's, accurate this is. The translation. <laughs> <laughs> Merry fucking Christmas. It's both fucking diggity. You're fucking welcome. <laughs> you mean, gentlemen, I know it's Christmas show time, and I know I've already made one voicemail this week, and there was in a sleep deprived state where my mom wasn't in the right place. So I'm going to translate for that shit. I was real tired, and I felt like yelling. So there you go. Translation complete. <laughs> Merry Christmas. I didn't watch Raw. Glad I didn't. Read about it. Sounds like shit. Fuck you, miss. And I'm done. Um, Merry Christmas. Have a good time. Get drunk. Have a designated driver. Bo Diggity wants you to be motherfucking safe. That's what Bo Diggity is about. He is about wooing, going crazy, but also safety. Home safety, personal safety, uh, vehicle safety as well, for the most part. Uh, so, uh, Bo, F Diggity. Yes. Flight plans. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you go. The F should be I'm for Estelle Getty. Yep. I'm on board. I really thought he actually had said Estelle Getty, and that was the only <laughs> thing I read. <laughs> what a bummer. What a drag. Well, folks, we want to thank you for another successful round of, uh, of fan mail, Wrestling Mayhem fan mail. We love hearing from you, the Mayhem Americans. That was good shit. That was a good fucking round, wasn't it? That was good shit. Did you like that, Riz? High five. High five. Fucking high five for Riz. That's what's going on. What happens now? <laughs> what happens now? What happens now? Well, we, we do come now. to a screeching halt. We talk to the youngest member of our board, what wearing a yellow shirt, 
with his newly redesigned facial hair. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> aim for fucking face. Cody Rhodes is like a slight Damian Sandow. No. No. Yeah. no. Like you do not compare yourself listen, to Damian listen, Sandow. Listen, listen, no one's going to match that. This degenerated you. quickly. Damian Sandow is a whole other fucking level that I can't even touch, okay? What's Wrestle Damian Fan? Wrestle Fan. Wrestle Fan. Wrestle Fan. That has not been seen in WWE since Mike Knox. Wrestle Fan. What federation does Damian Sandow wrestle for? He wrestles for the WWE. Well, then shut the fuck up because it's time for the Indie Minute. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck the mainstream. <laughs> <laughs> yes! <laughs> That's your new motto! That's it. That's the catchphrase. Fuck the mainstream. It's time for the Indie Minute. This is the Hipster Pro Wrestling Minute. So ladies and gentlemen... <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Dude, uh, I like Dean Ambrose before this, he was cool. Guys, 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 this cough medicine's fucking me up, I swear to God. <laughs> <It's cough. laughs> I forgot he's on cough medicine. <laughs> this is the best show in the world. <laughs> and he's on cough medicine. Do it. Do it now. No, don't do it. Don't do it. No, no, no. no, no you'll no, fuck, no, up, no. You'll fuck no. up your little baby kidneys. <laughs> <laughs> I need those. Uh, to this. <laughs> because it's Follow the Christmas the dark holidays, side. it's time for merriment, and it's also time for wrestling, which means companies are putting on a shit ton of pro wrestling this weekend, and it's going to be a hey, fun Daddy, time dude. all around. So first, let's talk about our good friends at IWC, International Wrestling Cartel. Their big event is this Saturday, December 15th, for Winner Takes All. Last week on the show, if you listen in, we had an interview with the IWC Heavyweight Champion Logan Chulo and the IWC Super Indie Champion Michael the Bomber Facade. Yes, we did! We did! Because we were going to be facing each other uh, this Saturday in a 30-minute Iron Man match. Hallelujah! Yeah! Yeah. Yeah. Iron Man 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 match peels off. I'm going to put it inside you. (laughs) (laughs) Show title. (laughs) No, no. (laughs) No, no, no. This is private time. This is gonna That's go in the bottom. Lunchbox is having a very special 30 minute iron butthole match. <laughs> <laughs> but also on yeah. that card, if you're, in, iron Man match. Uh, if you're in the Elizabeth PA uh, area, you don't get to see just. A 30-minute Iron Man match. You get to see stars like Tommy Dreamer, Colin Delaney, Sammy Callahan, Chuck Taylor, Bobby Fish, Anthony Neese, and so much fucking more. It's going to be a goddamn party. If you want more information and tickets, you can go to IWCWrestling.com in the Elizabeth PA uh, area. Sorgatron Media will be there. It's in the email. (laughs) Oh, shit. (laughs) Sorgatron Media will be there. Uh, so, yeah, go to IWCWrestling.com. Go get your tickets. Go to Winner Takes All and have some fun. But if you are not going to Winner Takes All and you are still in the PA area, closer to the West Newton area, go to our good friends at RWA, uh, RWALive.com. They have their Season Beatings 4 event uh, this Saturday, uh, <laughs> uh, same night as IWC. So if you're in that area, go check them out. Main event. For the RWA Championship, Shane Taylor going against G. Raver. That should be a fun old time. Uh, and more and more more great stuff from them. So if you want to check them out, go to rwalive.com. Get your tickets and hopefully be in the West Newton, PA area. Say hi to our good friend Wheels. He's there. And hi, Wheels. You know, permission to chop him. Hi. Wheels. And, and make, okay, his, make, his, make, make his Christmas. Don't do what Lunchbox is doing right now. You better behave. I'm sending the Don't team back. out again. What are we doing? Hey, Dude. that's okay. We're gonna have fun, and you're gonna miss Super Oprah. I want to miss Super Oprah. Yeah. Why is that not on the poster? I need to talk to you guys about promotion. Cause he gets Super Oprah. <laughs> yeah, put Super Oprah on the poster. What's she look like? 
She looks like it, it, Oprah, it looks but like super. Oprah. I'm on board. All right. Oh, really? Does, does she go around in like battle royals and say you get board. a suplex and you get a suplex and you get a suplex? Oh, I wish. I wish. I wish. I got. I got a match I need to show you, LB. So you know what's going on with Super Oprah. Shit. It's in the Sorgatron Media Library. She wrestling Dan Sandwich? No, she's oh, wrestling. Who is she wrestling? <laughs> Please, she wrestle that show. Sandwich? That's not even a match. That's a squash match. Did she wrestle a chest flexor or something? Oh yeah, probably chest flexor. So yeah. That makes sense. Deadman in the Conqueror. Yes. I'm, I'm a fan. I'll, I'm on top of that. Wrestle fans, you have a special Christmas present for me this year, and you're going to talk about Dan Sandwich in this, uh, the final indie minute. Yes, yes. Uh, Dan Sandwich has an event coming up. If you want more information, go to dansandwich.com. Fuck you for getting my hopes up. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck I you. Just, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Lunchbox. I just want to make you happy. You made him cry. You're why I He's drink. He's going to shove that bottle. made him up. cry. Good job, Wrestle fan. Dan, Dan Sandwich I hope is you're so happy. Dan Sandwich is off the face of the planet. No one knows what's happening to Dan Sandwich. <laughs> I knew what happened to Dan Sandwich. Dan Sandwich is setting up the first indie bed on the moon. <laughs> That's what's happening. <laughs> wow. Yep. All right. Right, 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 yeah. right behind the ear. Uh, and, 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 and if you are not in the PA area, but you are in the Texas area, there is an event this Sunday no. that you are truly will be attending, and that is Anarchy Championship Wrestling's Delusions of Our Childish Days, December 16th. Wow. Does that, awesome. that even Dramatic fit on event? the poster? Yeah. yeah, titles are fun, guys. Okay. So, yeah. If you've ever uh, wanted to jerk wrestle yeah, fan off with your angry. mouth, this is the event. Because he's going to be there. <laughs> this is your chance, Brandon Stroud. And they he's never hire He's going to be high on cops here, folks. Take oh, advantage of it. Are they really, are they really yeah. doing the Godfather music? Yeah, apparently they are. Sorry. Sorry about that. Gambinos, they are. Yeah. Um, but if not just to, you know, I guess jerk me off with your mouth, which apparently that's okay. Um, <laughs> Only in Texas. <laughs> yeah. 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 He said it was totally fine. Also, uh, I love America. <laughs> America. Speaking of loving America, there will be a six Joshi family Christmas death match for the ACW heavyweight title. <laughs> the Japanese Japanese title. I'm sorry. Christmas death match. Family Christmas death match. There will be presents with weapons inside. With sweet. Family. Yeah. Is it like family. Jokey Smurf? <laughs> I oh, I uh, Russell up. fan. Russell fan. You need to scream during that match. You'll put your eye out if someone opens the present. That's a <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, running funny joke of a, a movie. Russell Fan doesn't uh, get it. He does not yeah, get it. Too moving young. on. Too young. Even though it's on every year, I don't get the joke. No, you don't. Fuck you, fetus. What? Also, also on that show, uh, the uh, WSU World Champion Jessica Havoc makes her return to Anarchy Championship Wrestling as she takes on Jacobs Pliskin. Also, the return of CZW Heavyweight Champion Masada. Uh, it's going to be a ton of fun. If you uh, are in the Austin, Texas area, go run. to Anarchy. I'm sorry, everyone's talking. <laughs> Uh, go to anarchychampionshipwrestling.com. Uh, it's at the Mohawk 912 Red River Street this mm. Sunday. Mm. Go mm. check it out. I hope Texas, to see you there. Texas Maybe. Anarchy. Texas Anarchy says, uh, I still plan on slapping him at the show. It's a tradition. Good. Yeah, that's I fine. That's day. fine. Yeah. Yeah. Don't I want, I want me, video or stop. it didn't happen. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Just don't do that thing Lunchbox told you. Dude. No, do it. No, do it. Do that. Do it while I'm you're gonna... chopping. Yeah. Is that it? Oh, that that's painful. Um, actually, no. Because... <laughs> sorry. Oh, great. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm going to try to rush you. I'm just trying speaking, to get an accurate. Speaking of that, uh, as we segments. talked about a couple weeks on the show, more names have been announced for the National Pro Wrestling Day. National, National Pro, Pro Wrestling, Wrestling Day. Day? National Pro Wrestling Day. National, National Pro, Pro Wrestling Day. Day. National Pro Wrestling Day. Day. There's way too many people be saying that. <laughs> there's too many voices. I didn't uh, get to say it last week. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, uh, no sports entertainment day? <laughs> those names include people like Anarchy Championship Wrestling, St. Louis Anarchy, Metro Pro Wrestling. Just added to the list of tons of names that will be there for National Pro Wrestling Day in National the month of February. What handy hour. Oh, if, CPWE. I actually know people at CPWE. <laughs> oh, no. no. We're not playing that no, game. No, no. 
No, if you do that, that I will cool. ban you from the hangout. That was the only one. Um, so, yeah, so if you want more information on that developing event, you can go to nationalprowrestlingday.com. Nationalprowrestlingday.com? Nationalprowrestlingday.com. That's what we did. Yeah. yeah. I'll start a new one. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. yeah. That thing. Beans. So also, uh, if you are in uh, beads, beads, no beads, beads. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Beads, beads, anal beads. We're talking about anal beads, wrestle fan. Beads, ah, beads. <laughs> beads have stingers on their butts. What else, wrestle fan? What else? <laughs> Ring of Honor has an eye pay per view coming up this weekend. Russell fan, what else? Ring of Honor has an eye pay per view. <laughs> no, it doesn't work. Oh. No. Stop, stop <laughs> my response like it's a question. I need it. I need another God, swing. All done. No, Russell uh, fan, no! Don't <laughs> swig on anything. Russell fan, swig. <laughs> no. Do a shot. <laughs> Big no, ladder no, war: no. Kevin Steen versus El Generico. Uh, also, the TV titles on the line when Adam Cole takes on Matt Hardy. Uh, Jerry Lynn's final Ring of Honor match as he takes on the prodigy Mike Bennett. Uh, like I said, if you're in the New York area, it will be at the uh, believe the Hammerstein Ballroom or the Manhattan Center. It's either one of the two. They're kind um, of the same thing. <laughs> There's the same, same, same one and show up and you're good. They're but, the same but if thing. You're also, Hammerstein Ballroom is just a separate room inside the Manhattan Center. Yes. Good. He, he knows the layout. Yes, um, but if you I, are I not there, the you city. can check it out on my pay per view if you Dance. want the information for that. Go to ROHWrestling.com and check them out. Show them some love and get some taste of pro wrestling this holiday season. And the last thing. Oh, he's still going. I know, because Lunchbox is going to be dancing. He's dancing. Now he's going to go for a wrestling day. <laughs> Fast that. Beans. Hey, Lunchbox. What's, what's up, wrestling man? <laughs> hey, <laughs> sandwich? There is, after you're done being a chicken, Lunchbox. What's up, you what? Share, you, you shared this story with me. Uh, big news coming it's out of the It's about women. <sighs> It's about, <laughs> whenever I see in my wrestling feed, whenever I see something interesting about a wrestler who's oh no, this one's actually good. <laughs> well, if it's, I like how you point to the microphone. It's like who, it's that's who I'm talking. To. I know you're talking to the microphone. That's where the voice goes. Um, <clears throat> that's why I put my balls on it earlier. <laughs> no, I didn't. Sorry, it's okay. <laughs> no, it's alright. It's about Body out. if it's an indie wrestler who's a lady. I said it's a wrestle fan because I'm like, well, he likes ladies who are indie. Um, he likes it's not like, getting the cookie. Remember, I you remember that scene in Fight like Club where they closed the door foods. and the door was just covered in um, like people's license plates of people that he quote saved. Uh, that's wrestle fans door, um, but it's uh, pictures of lady wrestlers that he's also quote saved. That that's true, <laughs> that's except for everything he just said. <laughs> And I think that's a fan of and he's not actual for wrestling day. <laughs> the actual news, the so, actual news was... Do you want me to, do, me to, do, you want me to do the story? I'll do the story. I remember You can it. do it if you want. I, I, I'm, I'm going to drink some cough medicine. You do the story. Don't drink no, the no, cough medicine. Anymore. Cough medicine. No. 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 Medicine. So, you, just, you remember Daisy, Daisy Hayes? Influence. Yeah. yeah, I remember Daisy Hayes. Yeah, she's back. Yay! Yay! She was out for like a year. She wanted to recover. She wanted to. She was like anorexic or super anorexic. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, Although the picture, fun. the picture I sent WrestleFan, she had a, a six pack. Um, I think it was when she was in Ring of Honor doing stuff with Delirious. Yeah, she was like kind of scary. She was ripped. really like yeah. like, yeah. like unhealthy. Yeah. There there were questions about her uh, health, and the the statement when she had did left uh, did leave about like a year and a half ago was that left. she was when she I, had. I, I elected myself. He, he is I'm from in the Texas. south. I'm in the south, and I'm on cough syrup. When she had did left, the statement that she done that put out was that she wanted <laughs> that to focus was on herself and her woman. When she done did that thing. <laughs> Basically, she was leaving for health reasons, and uh, this past weekend she returned, uh, not in a wrestling role, but she was a manager, I believe, for Mischief, who had a match at an event. Um, so, but that's cool because basically she's been sort of like off the radar for like a long time. No one really knew like what she was doing, you know. Uh, so that's good to see that she's back, and uh, hopefully we can see uh, more of her in the pro wrestling world because she was definitely a very uh, Big innovator and big proponent in great uh, female pro wrestling. So, 
Yeah, these. Fuck it, it's your segment. Keep going. <laughs> no dead so air in your segment. If you're gonna end Stay it, on. you wrap it up like a professional. And the notes, and as I finish up the notes, I'm Ron Burgundy, and that my friend, <laughs> is the indie minutes for this week. My God, week. my God. we you, had a friend. professional here earlier in the night from TV, and you didn't learn nothing by his presentation. <laughs> Jim Loke. Jim Loke. Oh, okay. Jim Loke is a magical, mystical, mythical creature. Mm-hmm. That's all. Yep. That's all the oh, M's. Yeah, I got so mythical. I didn't repeat myself. Texas. Jim fucking Loke. What's that? Texas Anarchy says Russell Fan is destroying Texas. <laughs> right on. Oh, are you misrepresenting your home with his face I- balls? Your own country? I, oh no, that, that's actually not true at all. I'm perfectly representing them. <laughs> I think I thought you did a good good job there, Junior. Um, because I only had to take two <laughs> hits off of my uh, can of uh, compressed air Water? while you were talking. <laughs> 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 oh, this is, this is the most only, only twice. Usually, ever. I have to do it three, Arnold. maybe four times. So <laughs> on the list I, I would say you did a decent oh, wow. job. <laughs> on the list of things I didn't expect for him to pull out, that was on there. <laughs> That's why I'm sucking up some of that sweet candy. Crust <laughs> air. Well, holy shit, that was great. That was that was awesome. <laughs> was that is that actually was that it? Is that all? Rest that was legitimately it. What else? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing else. What else? Nothing now else let's look then. back. You know what? Uh, you know what, Lunchbox? Yes. <clears throat> we need to look back. We do need to look back. We need to look back on the year that was. Well, but first of all, how we fucked up the year that was. How, how we did? How, we, how did? we fucked up the year that was. We did all right. No, because we had predictions for what was going to happen in 2012. Oh, oh my God. Oh, you looked predictions? up the predictions. I listened to all the show until Mad Mike's email, and then the podcast app crashed on my iPhone. <clears throat> uh, and That's I was in traffic, bomb. so it wasn't going to fix it. This is the bomb. Hold on. Well, we're going to find that email, maybe. Is uh, this, wait, is this I, one, email? one, I've emailed this to all of you. Yeah, on the Good Times account. Oh, and if I can Sorg. find my Shit. phone... Sorg, wait, Sorg. What? Isn't this the part where we take a break to show Mad Mike's video? Wait. Yes. Yeah. So but before we get that, let's go to Mad Mike's Minute of Mayhem. 60 seconds, go! Hey, guys, it's Mad Mike. Once again, you your Minute of Mayhem. And done. Um, <laughs> what happened, guys? One guy's it lost. It sucks. Fuck you. Back to you, LB. I didn't. I didn't set my timer, so I'm gonna have to just think that I was a minute. Good work. Right. Yeah, good, good work. Good. Uh, good. Good. Hi, tiny good. dog. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 no. It's in his mouth. That was exciting. A tiny, a tiny dog put his head in my mouth like I was a lion and he was a little person. Oh, he's not drunk. That little dog is now drunk. That's correct. <laughs> yep. um, okay, Sorg sent me. Sorg, Sorg, are we gonna do that? And then we're. Gonna, is this our remember when? You, well, no. Well, remember when is gonna be like, yeah, the predictions from last year. Well, okay. I got my predictions too, Sorg. And we can kind of talk about. I don't want to get right into the predictions, but I also want to talk about like kind of your review, what like kind of happened, kind of stuff. Oh, what was oh, a big. Oh. Highlights of the year for you guys. It's also so, uh, yeah, it's, it's also the predictions from the awesome. It cast. is also the predictions from the awesome cast. And you might most the grammar because I most did most of these via Siri. Um, <laughs> no, so, who's, oh, Yanni. Uh, okay. Yes. Uh, uh, don't don't Siri and drive, folks. Okay. Uh, I predicted. St- well, uh, let's let's do it like this. Okay. Wait, sort. We'll sort. No. We'll are we we'll, we'll save our new predictions for the end of the show. Wow. These Why did not translate too well. Start yes, but these are the old year. ones. Okay. Uh, apparently, a lot of us were predicting that because we had the promos from Chris Jericho, mm-hmm. and a lot of us predicted it was going to be Shane and Stephanie, and I think I was one of them. That's right. Uh, a few of us were. Chachi predicted the promo as Vince. Uh, of course, we all know it's Chris Jericho. It wasn't, but Tried Vince did eventually come back. Why yeah. and I still Yanni. going to suck? Yanni. Oh, 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 I see. Uh, uh, so, uh, I think uh, uh, well, uh, Matt Mike, uh, I know in his email said that he was going to predict, or, or maybe in his minute uh, predicted that uh, oh, TNA God. was going to get so bad that he was going to stop doing his reviews. I'm rich. So yes. good job, good job, Matt Mike, on getting that. I, I also I also said that CM Punk and Daniel Bryan would have a pay per view world title match. Yes, you league. did. Yes, you did. Also, props mm-hmm. to that. Uh, and actually, because uh, I'm looking at my thing, I have Sting will retire in TNA and be the first entrant to their Hall of Fame. Oh, right. like half right. Yeah, yeah, you get that one. You get that one. Mm-hmm. And really, look at what he does now. Not too different from retiring. Mm-hmm. No, now he's now he's dead because someone hit him with a hammer. Uh oh oh, there's that too. That's too. <laughs> 
Chris Jericho predict. I'm uh, sorry, Chachi predicts that Chris Jericho will not be back in 2012. Chris Jericho predicted that Chachi will not be back, and it came true. Yes. <laughs> Bobby predicts that Carmen. What? Karma. Karma. Oh, oh no, no, we're skipping that one because that one wasn't actually nice oh, that's, uh, because of what happened. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, Bobby did predict that uh, Ziggler would win Money in the Bank and win a WWE Championship. Uh, Half right, Bobby. Good well, job. He still got one more. Hey, the year ain't over on that one. Good job, Bobby. You got props does for it, that. Does it, does it still count if he loses it? No. I mean, loses the actual Money in the Bank? Uh, he, do we, will we still Russell want it? Fan, he's not going to lose... Sorry, sorry. Yeah. You were here for the for the Impact Hangout. Russell Fan and I have a bet. A bet? We do have a bet. Are you? We have, we have a bet. Are we putting money on a fake sport again? Because because yeah. I believe that John Cena is going to beat Dolph Ziggler for the Money in the Bank, and everyone yeah. else is delusional. Winner gets to be power I'm teaching bottom. Russell Fan the ills of a <laughs> Russell Fan and I have bet five whole dollars, and the loser must also talk nicely about the winner the next time they're on the show. Mm. Mm. So in other words, first wrestling mayhem show of January. Expect to hear a wrestle fan sucking my dick. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. 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 No, I that's think a that's, that's, that's too nice. That's not right. All right, moving on. Moving on. Riz, you predicted that SmackDown would be no more or move to a different channel or perhaps the internet. Well, how do you respond to that? Actually, ribs predicted. Oh, yeah, ribs, <laughs> ri ribs critiqued that. I was in traffic using Siri. I couldn't check it, okay? At least I did it. I did my due diligence. <laughs> <laughs> I want to screen. That was beautiful. I want to screen cap of you shouting, shouting and, and big, in big white letters. I did my due diligence. <laughs> <laughs> Wrestling <laughs> Mayhem <laughs> Meme 2013. <laughs> I did my due diligence. Riz, <laughs> respond to the man. But yeah, I was... You remember me hitting you from last year because you're jumpy. <laughs> I know. <laughs> 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 I'm sorry. That's probably the only time I'm going to do it. There's nice touches from here on out. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say? Smackdown? Anyways, I, I was... I like When it happened, I thought it was going to be on either WWE Network or on YouTube, like, <clears throat> stars or anything like that. But I'm going to take my my uh, my bow and say I was wrong. You, you, don't, you don't have to be sad that you were... It, it was just Shut up, like, Russell fan! It wasn't like... <laughs> no! This is my turn to talk now. You have a whole fucking minute! It wasn't like you bet your whole family and children on the fact that SmackDown was going to be canceled. He's still yelling. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Yeah, back to the list. Back to the list. Uh, uh, Lunchbox, you predicted that Watch the Box. WWE Network. Watchbox. <laughs> you predicted Watch the Box. WWE Network would go eight months and then start showing reruns of Bad About You and MASH, which would make it the uh, network specifically programmed for you. That's exactly right. And I haven't been proven wrong because that shit is <laughs> not right. And I would like to jump ahead a little bit. Watchbox projects <laughs> Muppets return to Raw. What happened last oh, night? Man. Fucking Muppets back on Raw. <laughs> I accept your apologies. Thank you very much. <laughs> and this is exciting because I came into this tonight wanting to bring up Mad About You. I was like, I'm going to work Mad About You into a conversation <laughs> on the Mayhem Show tonight. I don't know how. And um, there you go. And me from the past did it. <laughs> <laughs> And you apparently, also, apparently, you were also predicting the future. <laughs> because you were talking about how Sharman's ten times more badass than Rick Ross. And there he and is. Look, there he is on the show. Oh. Apparently, sort of. <laughs> He said, you said Charmaine is ten times. <laughs> That's how Charmaine <laughs> translates in Siri. It's a, I'm, I'm, his wife right it's there. I'm Weissflock? <laughs> I translated as Weissflock. Hey, I'm Watchbox. Oh, DJ Weissflock. The, the best part is, for one of them, it did translate Lunchbox. It did. It got it right. Jim. So <laughs> maybe, maybe my time. drinking... Maybe my drinking started before <laughs> class and driving. Who knows? Sure, that's no good. From the sounds of it. We have a really child on the air. We can't, That's a bad well, example. The child did drink a 
chug a whole thing. Of and that is I'm not fault. driving. I'm we not have to, to live wheel. with that. No, we have to. But live we can still yell at it. Or what is happening here? What's happening to this camera? Do I keep kicking it? I think so. I think so. It's all right. There you, hey, buddy. there you are. There you are. You're squared in. You have all those nice flowers and lights behind you. A puppy keeps are you nipping do it at yourself? me. He's gonna do it himself. <clears throat> what? He's gonna feed himself. I don't have to put it in his mouth. Yes. <laughs> He's <laughs> eating the label. <laughs> I, yeah, do that. Worse than. Yeah, don't worry about recycling. I've been, I've been rubbing my gross hands all over it all night. I know. And holding it between my firm <laughs> loins. <laughs> all right, let's look back. LB. But uh, let's look back. Let's look back uh, to. Okay. Um, what are we going to look back on? The uh, year that yes. was. The year that was. In WWE, let's in, say. In WWE. Uh, okay. Uh, that's. And we're going to talk about that our favorite weeks. Uh, our favorite, <laughs> our favorite moments from. My favorite week, this my past favorite past week was. Shut up! Fuck all of you! <laughs> <laughs> our favorite moments <laughs> from this. Uh, you're walking away and can't switch around for remember when. <laughs> National Pro Wrestling Week. All right. National Pro Wrestling Week. We're going to... 2012 was a crazy year in the WWE. Things happened. People wrestled. And we're going to remember when... Nope. Sword, change it. Shut up. No. It's going to be awkward. It's going to be good comedy because it's going to stay on us for too long. (laughs) Nope. (laughs) Learn that from watching Adult Swim. <laughs> Folks. <laughs> Folks, 2012 was nuts, wasn't it? It was crazy. Riz? It was crazy. That shit that was, was crazy. crazy shit. What do you remember? <laughs> what stands out? You know what? Honestly, right. I'm, I'm, I'm stalling because I'm trying to remember. <laughs> Fucking 2012 wasn't crazy. 2012 was shitty. What interesting thing happened? CM Punk. Uh, CM, CM Punk. Punk. CM Punk. That was it. Okay. CM Punk happened. Let's talk about it. Damien Sandow happened. Dame, CM Punk, Damien Sandow. Cesaro. Cesaro. Barrett. Oh, God, yeah. Barrett. Cody Rhodes. These people are young and they are breakout stars. We had the realization awesome. that in 2012, so at some point when we weren't really looking, put this in your mouth. When we weren't looking, <laughs> thinking about looking, all of the old stars that we were tired of watching went away. We're not watching Triple H do half-hour promos at the top of Raw every week. We're not watching Ric Flair having matches that really not that great. No. It's not the same people. It, it, even, it's even not even Cena. John Cena. Yeah. It's not even John Cena. The era of Super Cena has passed. He's in a mid-card feud with Dolph Ziggler and uh, banging a tiny crazy chick. Problem. Hornswoggle? Horn, I don't want to talk about Hornswoggle. You're going to upset me. Oh. <laughs> we, we did see a lot of diva departures, specifically diva departures. Uh, the Bellas are There's gone. Routine, Beth um, Phoenix is gone. Do you want to bring up your, your boo? Karma went away sorry, for various Bellas, reasons. Kelly Kelly. Um, Kelly, you know, Kelly. Um, Kelly Kelly went away. Um, a lot of these, the Maurice, people, people. Maurice left, Maurice. which I think was a huge blow to the Divas division. Nah, um, really. well, she was certainly uh, the most attractive her. of them. Uh, yeah, that's true. Yeah. Anyway, the point is, uh, it was it was the era of the new up and coming star. And that's good. That's something for years, for fucking years on this show. We were we were agonizing. We wanted that. We wanted new and interesting people. And by God, now we have it. What the fuck are we going to bitch about now? Everything else. Oh, and we have a tag I'll division again. Tag division. Tag division. Mad, Mad Mike. Mike. Tag Mad team wrestling. Mike, tell us about tag team wrestling. Dude, we are. Last night on Raw. There was a four-team so elimination you, match. So I got carried away. Where there are We're still camera, two other teams petting. that are popular and in title contention. But last time we were able to say that the WWE had six legitimate teams was 2001, I think. Like, they, had a, hold on, they had a four-way tag team match that's leading to another tag team match at the pay-per-view. That's leading to another tag team match for the championships. You know, yeah, yeah, that's true. And to be it's fair, tag team the Shield is also another tag team that we can throw in there. So they have seven yeah, so yeah. tag teams. That's something else. We we talked about that back in the day. We would wax and what what we would 
Wax philosophical. What? Wax, 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 wax philosophical. Thank you. Yes, it's a thing. Wax philosophical. Wax about. <laughs> Remember the days of tag team wrestling and stables. They're fucking back. They're giving us everything we wanted. What else? What else? Shireman. Shireman, what stands out to you in WWE in the past year? I think the best thing that happened in the WWE this year was Raw 1000. In the lead up to it, they brought back, they rolled out all those old fogies getting in there and letting Heath Slater wrestle these guys. <laughs> I thought it was the best thing that's happened in years on that show. And another lead it comes out, okay. stone drunk. Does a moonsault <laughs> right in the middle of the ring. Exactly. Another thing with you know, that, the APA yeah. comes out. Roddy Piper is out there. It, Vader, Vader, Fat Vader he comes out and bonds him. It's awesome. No. Well, How can you beat like that thing? Booger. I have a disease where I see Bash and Booger yeah. everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Bash and Booger but, disease. Title. But yeah, when, <laughs> when we were going over what we would like to see for 1,000. <laughs> anniversary next year. Yeah. But when we That's saw Raw sick. 1000 come up, we were like, okay, what weird thing would you like to see that we know wasn't going to be shown? We asked that question on the Mayhem Show every week for a month before Raw 1000. We just kept asking we it. Said, I asked it in the YouTube shit. videos I made. <laughs> again and again. We did no one answer. Choppy choppy pee pee. Yes. May Young's hand. Yeah. Uh, oh, what, else? The hand. what else? <laughs> I forgot I the know, hand. I know we did grown something up. else. That that what was that? The hand is all grown up. Yeah, the hand is all grown up. But we did that knowing that they weren't going the to do that because yes. it's <laughs> but then they did then it. Then they did it, they and did it. it freaked us out. Because <laughs> they're listening to us right now. Raise your hand if you what pooped a... yourself when you saw the hand. There you go. Right it's there. Raising my dog. Yeah, out there. Yeah. Right. I love the hand. Dude, that was really unfortunate. You want to know, and I'll elaborate on that, Riz. You want to know how much they're listening to us? <laughs> Last night, The Miz compared Damian Sandow and Cody Rhodes as a tag team to a shocker. That's yes! Something, the pink that's and the something stink. we would say on Twitter because we like to talk about buttholes and vaginas. <laughs> they know we're listening! They know! They love, know we want to talk about the buttholes and vaginas! I love how WrestleFan has distilled our conversation to buttholes well, and vaginas. It's oh, all Have not you wrong. listened to this show? He's not wrong. It's not wrong. The shocker, he was assuming that Damian Sandow gave Cody Rhodes a dirty Sanchez, which I will now call a dirty Sandow. Which, uh, uh, which in all honesty, Miz <laughs> probably shouldn't be. Miz probably shouldn't be saying that on television. But it was. I. Yeah, we were all fuck like, up. No, there's nothing wrong with that. There's no, nothing wrong with that. No, no, no. You're allowed to put innuendo on television. That is fine. Wrestle that fan. Far of innuendo. In your endo. Yeah. Yeah, that's very forward. Do you know ten year olds know what the shocker is? How do you think the Simpsons have lasted this long? Simpsons Everybody did it. All sex yeah. jokes. There, there you have it. <laughs> I have a new question. Okay, new question. Another new uh, nostalgic question. 2012 had its highs and lows. Sorg, I'm going to start with you. What was your biggest wrestling disappointment of 2012? Biggest letdown? The Ryback's in a main event of anything? Yes. <laughs> yes, he sucks. I mean, no, 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 I mean, I got, I got to I mean, I understand. I, I understand why he's there. I get it. I got, I got a kid in my class that's like all like right back, you know, like gay, you know, um, and that's cool, you know, and I get it, you know, I get why he he's big, you know, I get why people are behind him, you know, because he's like a crazy jacked up RVD, right? So okay, I get that. To be fair, he was only there because Cena got injured. That's true. That is true, too. He wouldn't even have this opportunity if it wasn't for Cena getting injured, right? We'd still be seeing 
Punk and S Cena going back and forth here until it gets to you know the the Rock. Until it gets to the Royal Rumble. When it's until it gets to the Royal Rumble, right? I mean that that, that makes sense, right? I mean, maybe somebody else get thrown in there. But we got Ryback, and, and you gotta you gotta you gotta you know how many times will we bitch about WWE is not listening to everybody, right? How many times we talk about WWE says you know they're not they're not giving us what we want, even though this is the year where we got CM Punk no. and freaking Daniel Bryan. <laughs> we got Seth Rollins in a match with Daniel Bryan. Yeah, we did. Coming up here, we have Seth Rollins main eventing a pay per view against. Holy him. shit! Yeah, yeah. They're fucking listening to us. Yes, because... but they're always li they're also <laughs> listening to the rest of their fans, the ones that are yelling, "Feed me more." It's happening out there. This is for real. The chants are for real. They're happening on Raw. So they're, they're listening to the chants. Are, the chants are happening on Raw because Ryback's chanting that's, that's "Feed me more." That's what it comes down to. I you know, logged on the black. To, I logged on the Black Ops the other night, and I was killing the guy called "Feed me more." Yeah. <laughs> That it's goes to show huge. you. Yeah. It's huge. Is it, it's, somehow this worked. It's simple. It's just some dude kicking ass. Yeah. That people can get behind that. It's, it's a, simple. It's, it's not. Formula. It's not complicated. It's not like that stupid ladder match we saw with four people and, and three run-ins that we saw in WCW <laughs> in the ladder match special on WWE.com. Oh my God. Oh, so it also bad. gives credit to how big of a heel CM Punk is. Because if you that don't have that a huge heel right. that's like intensely over, <laughs> like Hollywood Hogan was there. back in the it's old NWO really days, wrong. then a Goldberg type character does not work. I'm just saying. Nice. Yeah. Exactly. He's, exactly. You're not wrong. Cowardly Thank you. running away. Yeah, and, 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 and that's it. what heels do. Mm -hmm. Right. Right. Good heels. So. CM Punk. I, I find it interesting. They've they've transitioned CM Punk in, from telling the truth heel to cowardly heel. Over the past few, yeah, months. but but he busts, he busts, he busts, he kind of needs to. He makes it he work. Bust, he busts the truth out every once in a while when he needs it, like he did last night. Like, Let's be honest. I mean, well, like, what do you do with Ryback other than being like a big guy that I'm afraid of as a normal sized person? Yeah, exactly. I mean, he kind of has to. Yeah. What would your reaction be if you were had to be like, hey, you got to deal with Ryback? I'd run out through the crowd. I, I would <laughs> run out through the crowd or uh, hire hire an alcoholic to come in with a taser. Throw me at him at once. <laughs> nice. say, tase that nice giant reference. motherfucker so I can him with a bazooka. <laughs> nice reference there, LB. That's good. Thank you, sir. Cheers. Uh, I, I think I think one of the biggest disappointments, and I know I'm going to get a lot of argument probably from the chat. God. Chris Jericho's last run. I agree. No, I, I, agree. I think it felt. I, I, he, I, you know what? I, I, I agree. Um, Storyline and such. I thought it was really kind of bullshit. Good matches. Good matches. Good matches. We got oh, great Jericho matches. doesn't have put bad Jericho. matches. He, he no. literally just came in to put people over. Yeah. 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 Put, and, put Jericho in there with a fucking broom, and it's going to be great matches. Great yeah. jacket. But we got in that jacket. It was pretty awesome. Let's, let's be honest. His, when he but first, when he first came back. And he didn't say anything. Those first two promos, really, when he would just show up and then light up the jacket and grin and walk away. That was amazing. Downhill from there. <laughs> then he talked. As he started talking. It, and didn't to, really To be fair, though, he wasn't going to live up to uh, uh, for his feud with HBK. Oh, God. That's that was incredible. Thing. That was That, that could have been one of, the, one of the best things of his entire It was one of the yeah. best things of his entire career. Yeah. So far. Did you move one of those? I swear no, to God, Riz. <laughs> if the only you're only allowed to take those off your forehead if you put them in your mouth. That's the only place they're allowed to go, or if you shower them off at the end of the night. That's it. That is it. I I will follow um, you home. For the audio I'm, listeners, I'm not... LB has put pieces of a label on Riz's forehead, and it's not some sort of bodily no, fluid. It's, it's delicious wine label. They're stuck there with bodily label. fluid. I'm like the MacGyver of weird <laughs> sex shit. I'm changing my Twitter bio right yeah. tonight. I'm the guy for a weird <laughs> sex shit. Sex <laughs> shit. I, I, I bet the newspaper will love that. <laughs> <laughs> they don't know who DJ Lunchbox is. Have you yeah, been to a newspaper? I kept that shit <laughs> private. <laughs> who else? Who else? Somebody else tell me something that good. Something. No. Uh, something. A downer. Bad. Somebody else tell me a downer that happened in 2012 <laughs> in WWE. Oh, in WWE. Three hour Ross. Three hour Ross. Oh, three of the experiment. <laughs> That's not an experiment. Horrible. Hit and miss. 
I got one. Sleepy Robot. Hit Sleepy me. Robot. Riz. One. Riz. Sin Cara. Uh, no, I'm going to fight yeah. you on that one. Play, really? I think, I think Sin Cara is doing all right. No, no. When he first debuted, he was supposed to be this awe-inspiring guy who does flippy shit and does moves. <laughs> <laughs> to the extent of nobody. Sin Cara's a dolphin. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you seen the, when you saw the promos, you look at him and go, "Holy shit, that's Echo the Dolphin shit." <laughs> <laughs> but listen when, to me, fans at home. You fucking take Echo the Dolphin graphics. You Photoshop his mask on it. You send it to us. We'll put it on the air, and I'll smile at you. <laughs> I'll smile at you on the air. I'm on it. Bonus then, for Pacquiao laying there. But when he came in, out. when he came into WWE when he first started, right. he botched everything. He was horrible. Entrance. His, yeah, entrance. his entrance. His entrance was a trampoline. Botch her entrance. And it's a pretty he hard over entrance. the top rope. I think that phase is more into last year, though. I think 2012. Was I don't pretty care, Wrestle fan. This is my I'm time. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Am I gonna interrupt you when you're doing your shit? I'm just saying 2012 has been a pretty good year for Sin Cara. He's doing everything <laughs> that a Sin Cara yeah. needs to do, okay? He watched things so bad, they replaced him with another wrestler. Yeah, they, they, had, to, they had to move him was to another Camacho guy. It was Camacho. Yeah, it was, no, it was, it was, uh, no, it was Hunico. Hunico. It was Hunico. It was one, it was one of the guys Nicole. on the bikes. Yeah, but they, yeah, figured, they figured it out. Nicole. He's doing well now. Yeah, he still has that bad reputation. I think it's, I think it's great with Mysterio. Yeah, he's well, yeah. amazing with Mysterio. They cover he's each other's better. faults. The matches he has with Hamacho, Hamacho, Camacho, 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 Unico, Unico, and Camacho. With the other you Mexicans, you just combine Unico and Camacho. If listen, if you put Sin Cara in a ring with a Mexican, it's gonna be a good match. Oh, yeah. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, because they fucking know. They know. Del Rio. Del Rio. Fucking Del Rio, bring up, man. bring up the new Mystico, the guy with the crazy back knee from that they have in CMLL now. I watched that shit when what? I was in South Carolina. Bring it up, was magnificent. Bring him what's his name? Memo uh, Montenegro, whatever the fuck his name is. Fuck you. Memo. That's fucking racist. I don't want to hear it. it. How about, how about I know on. what I know what Negro means. Don't give me that shit. <laughs> <laughs> guys, guys. Wait, 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 preferred wait, nomenclature. Bobby, I got too, I got too close. Oh, 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 oh. Bobby, Bobby, Bobby. <laughs> what, what, what? How about El Local? Uh, oh, yeah? Hello, Cal. Hello, Cal. That's Wait, Saturday morning slam. Hello, Cal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, Cal. That's, uh, that, that's, that's Rodriguez. Yeah. Bumble Is it where? really? Okay. Yeah. 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 No, you didn't know that? Yes, I did. That's <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. You need to get it. Oh, get it. Oh, yes. I love that Bobby. Even, even when he puts his own title up, he can't keep his face above it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how it Look at everybody works. else. Look at everybody else. Look at where they're at. Maybe it's like, like, do you not have like a lot of clearance between your computer and your face? I don't know what's going on. Anybody else? Anybody else with... Uh, I got one. What's up? I got one. Tout. No, we're talking about Tout. The movie, Disappointment Tout. in Tout. 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 Yeah. Tout. I think that was... Wait a minute. That was more of a disappointment for the house. WWE. The point. Yeah. I got one. They what are you, what are you, what are you disappointed in about Tout there, Sherman? Oh, nothing. I just think it's a, you know, a WWE-backed social network dud, right? I well, mean, Robert Morris College is using it. Oh, fantastic. Oh, God, that's a great endorsement. <laughs> <laughs> I Fuck love you, RMU. Hey, yo, whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Wait, We're no. dissing Bo Bodega. Our friend of the show, Father Spoon, is behind that initiative. I'm I super I sorry, you, Spoon. Yeah. And you're dissing Bo Diggity's uh, um, alma mater. Oh, fuck. I didn't even know. <laughs> guys, look. Way to piss off everybody. Listen, guys, I'm drunk. Blame it on the apple wine. <laughs> <laughs> Three penis wine. Three penis wine. <laughs> All right, for the hangout, Bobby, Bobby, Bobby. Uh, Bobby. Disappointments. My disappointments. Hi, Bobby. Oh man. Not your personal it's disappointments about wrestling. I, 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 said, I, said, I said three hour raws. Yeah, yeah you did. Oh, that's right. That's right. All right, uh, wheels. Wheels. Disappointments in WWE. Uh, AJ with anybody better than me. <laughs> well, anyway, that's a personal disappointment. That, well, that, yeah. that's, so that's yeah. a true disappointment. AJ, you're right. Right. You're, no, he's right. That is a disappointment. AJ, the yeah. AJ, 
uh, she was in a great, interesting storyline, and then she was in a shitty GM storyline, and she's just now starting to recover. Yeah, okay. All right. Yeah. Okay. No, no. Seriously? The worst, and I agree in the chat room, was Warren Swaggle being the anonymous GM. Oh, my God. You're right. Fucking, I'm angry just remembering it. Level 10 disappointment. Wait, was that (laughs) really it? Did they yeah, really reveal that? that? Yeah. yeah. Where the fuck did they do that? Remember? I came on the show Remember? next week. That was yeah. when I started Hornswoggle Ruins Everything. Okay. That, that was, was a goddamn travesty. Remember oh. they bring, they brought back the, the computer for one night, and then Michael Cole and Jerry Lawler had a shitty match, and oh, then Santino came right. out and that's fucking... Right. They were uh, looking for the new GM. Oh, it was awful. After uh, Laurinaitis left. Laurinaitis, huge disappointment. Really? Uh, bullshit. Really? Every oh, fucking I thing he like, did was hope a nightmare. I thought you were behind it. I love John Lawrence. Yeah. Nice. No, I fucking hated him. I was with Chachi that anything, like, taking a shit is more interesting than watching John Lawrence nice do anything. Mm. <laughs> and I mean, like, an angry shit, like a burning <laughs> shit. Like, hey, I, I had got... Taco Bell, but it was past its prime. <laughs> Kind of like I left this taco out for a couple of days and it's real soggy, and I think the dog may have had its way with it, kind of shit. And I ate it anyway, and then I ate wow. three more tacos, kind of shit, like burning, like I might cry, like I might be crying in the stall at work, and I know I have to go back to work, kind of shit. Oh, this is that before has it. I sounds <laughs> way too personal experience. That's how bad John Laurinaitis was. <laughs> like that kind of shit where you can't even walk to the... Can't even walk. Can't even walk. <laughs> like you just have to sit there in the stall for a little bit and hope that your anus heals itself so you can go back to work and finish out your horrible day. <laughs> I've, I've got three okay, hours left hurts. at work and I have to do it with a burning asshole <laughs> because I didn't bring baby powder to work. I left it at home. That kind of shit. John Laronitis uses wet wipes. Oh, <laughs> oh my God! What's going on? Oh, I don't man. even know. There's okay, so that's enough with downers. Is Everything is depressing. <laughs> <laughs> what was great? Oh, did we do this already? Yeah, yeah, did we do this already? Russell Fan, did you yeah, have something to add? <laughs> your negativity. Oh, because I'm going to talk over you because you talked over everybody else. Go ahead. Uh, Lord Ted. That sucks. Moving on. He does <laughs> suck. Oh, he does suck oh. a lot. Wait, why? Wow. Why do you think? Let's bring Lord... this around. Can we really bring this around? Let's bring this around. Okay, uh, let's bring this around. That is, that is very... uh, uh. Third dimension sword. Third dimension sword. What happened this year? That was good. In TNA. TNA. What? Austin God. Aries. Sorg asked a challenging question. He's right, Austin Aries. Holy Austin Ryan. Aries was the CM Punk of TNA. Yeah, Joey Ryan. Yes. Uh, Zima Ion. Zima Ion. Good to see a friend of the show, Zima, Zima Ion. Show. Drink, drink. We can drink. Drink. Oh, fuck. All I have is cough medicine. No, don't, don't drink. drink it. <laughs> drink don't it. drink it. <laughs> I, you told me. Uh, no, it wasn't. Uh, I'm not going to do it. But no, seriously. Like, Zima Ion. Ion doing uh shima zion doing um different different uh good shit uh, uh destination x continuing as like the highlight of the year i think for a lot of us yep. i the, like that they added destination x being the disappointment of the year is all with what's that and the impact after destination x being the disappointment of the year is all that's with. typical but at least we didn't have extreme uh whatever you call it uh Morning happen again rising. hardcore justice hardcore uh with ecw thing. fake reunion show instead yeah. we had the fake reunion show up in manaka but anyways um and matt hardy mimi dance damage is damaged brain <laughs> <laughs> But, Seriously, but, but, no, but no, but, suck a dick. <laughs> yeah, nobody cares. Go away. <laughs> but but no, no, no. But like we, this Nation X was awesome. Austin Aries was awesome. The fact that they added this whole thing—that's the uh, X Division champion gets a <laughs> shot at the Thank the big you. belt, but has to give it up. I think is really cool. <laughs> the I, big it, boy it, belt. It's an yeah, the big boy belt. You know, awesome. but it, but it kind of like has that idea that like remember back in the day when the Destination, I'm sorry, the uh, X Division matches. Was uh, Joe, AJ, and, and Daniels like headlined pay per views? Yeah, it was because they were it's fucking awesome. Because because we knew that these were better matches, right? Yeah. Ultimate so that X idea that we kind of take that and we we, we incorporate the heavyweight belt into Destination X, but it gives it a little bit of weight. 
I consider Destination X more entertaining and more important than what happens with Bound for Glory, your fucking WrestleMania TNA. Next, LB. Hey, hey Sorg, Sorg, that's kind of a lead into a song I wrote. Uh, oh, boy. Oh, God, we didn't get into the songs yet. No, we didn't. <laughs> okay, real quick, uh, I want to say the best thing that happened to TNA this year was that they let Jeff Hardy do whatever the fuck he wanted. When he closed his eyes and wrote eyes on it, and sometimes he wears a helmet, and they fucking put that internal monologue <laughs> shit. <laughs> because now, he, he fucking, fucking wears a helmet nowadays. He wears happen? a goddamn uh, helmet. Oh, fuck got, Jeff well, Hardy. Okay, yeah. Fuck him. Fuck him in his stupid tattooed asshole. Listen, he's got the. I this was. Shut up. He's got the. He's got the text from the One Ring. It's the the Elven from the One Ring around his anus. Listen. Oh yeah. yeah. Because when he finally does too many fucking drugs and kills someone and ODs. All the all the prosecution has to do is show five minutes of TNA and say, I rest my case. <laughs> and that motherfucker goes to prison for life. <laughs> Wait, the, to be fair, one could say that being in TNA like, is I said serving killed time. someone. And you said he, he kills someone and then OD. Yes, and then they <laughs> fucking put him into expensive rehab that WWE will pay for because he used to be an employee and they fucked themselves on that one. And they have to save his dumb ass. And he'll fucking go to prison, and Matt Hardy will be like, Oh, my brother's in prison. Oh, I'm gonna get caught with some coke. And then he'll go to prison with him, and then they'll fucking both get fucked in the ass by someone who's actually in shape, and they'll shout, white, It'll be White Power Bill all over again. <laughs> fucking, <laughs> fucking stab him in the Power side, Bill. and Matt Hardy will be all like, I'm white. <laughs> And that'll be the end of the fucking Hardy Boys. That'll be what it. What is happening here? Something, ter I need, I something need terrible will happen. Power. Something <laughs> terrible will happen involving Jeff Hardy's anus and something diseased. And then he'll be all like, oh, I'm institutionalized. And then he'll fucking dig through a river of shit. Screen cap out. <laughs> he'll dig through a river of shit, but he'll still be guilty. And he'll try and come back to TNA. And they'll be like, No. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait TNA said no? Yeah, like, I don't give a side? fuck where you paint your eyes now, Sonny Jim. I think, I think Lunchbox's diatribe is what I liked about TNA this year. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. 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 All right, all that, no, that's enough about TNA. Fuck wait. that. <laughs> what? What? The world's greatest tag team. Of, oh, wait, no, no, wait, wait. That's, that's, that's our world right. champ. Wait. World, world tag, tag team champions of the world. World tag team champions of the world. That was pretty good. I'll team give him that one. Team Alpatini. Yep. Daniels and Kaz. Daniels and Kaz. Team Alpatini. Team Alpatini. <coughs> I have to, do you guys remember the um the fake baby shower they did, which was the funniest segment in all of Impact this year? No. 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 Because you know why? <laughs> we don't no. watch they that shit. Little, you, you know why? They had like a little Cupid doll with a fake AJ hoodie and... Because it had Claire Lynch in it. Screaming, it's your baby, and... Claire Lynch is a nice lady. <laughs> yeah, but she's a horrible actress. Yes, she picked a bad profession. <laughs> it happens to the best of us. <laughs> <laughs> she should just go into... Porn. Riz was a pole dancer for a year and a yeah. half. <laughs> <laughs> That's how we met. Predictions! Predic wait, did you wait, just do the face-off thing to him? Wait, yes. yeah. <laughs> oh, you gotta be on video for this one. That's the best in the world. <laughs> All right, are we doing now, sorry? Predictions. Four. I was gonna do a song. Oh, a song. We gotta do a song. song we have to do songs. song. All right, what we got there? Wait, man, Mike, set us up. All right. Well, as you guys know, I I, I write um, wrestling Christmas songs Eat every it. year. Man, Joe. Don't listen to her. It's a eat tradition. It. It, it, it's a tradition. Eat we it. probably it's have gonna be worse. You know it's going to be worse. Twenty-five songs, some odd, nope. like that. Um, and we were just talking about impact and how they really haven't had much hey. positivity this year. Oh yeah. So um, I, I I have a song, and um, if if you guys know it, it it's sung to the tune of um, White Christmas. Right, <laughs> Jack. <laughs> I what? know what white means. <laughs> all right, all right. Do we get lyrics? <clears throat> no. Did you send us lyrics? Can we sing along? Yes, it's in the it's in the thing. I can't get the on. Dock. I can't get on the thing. I can't get on the it's dock. At, I'm on it's my at iPhone. the bottom of the dock. You got it. You got it, man. Email. You got to email, man. All 
All right, I'll email it, God damn it. We want to sing along. <laughs> it's festive. <laughs> I asked Sorg if I should put it in the dog. He said put it in the dog. I was already Sorg. drinking. Sorg, I love this Instagram picture. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just shouting and, and I'm just flailing. Up, I'm just in the corner. like. <laughs> oh, I got this. I want to email this. Like, oh, there, I it. just sent it. I love America. America. Yeah. Fuck yeah. I get it. There it is. Oh. I got it. Has everybody got it? Do I have to find music? Yeah. No, it's alright. Everyone knows fucking White Christmas. Uh, alright, ready? Alright, alright, alright. All right. Ready? Ready? <clears throat> hold on, hold on. White. Here white. is your note. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Wrestle Fan. I was just about to do a joke like that. High five. High five. Hold on, hold on. I got some music. I don't, I don't know. These things usually don't match up too well, so we'll we'll oh see God. what this does. So we're gonna it. Do it. Hold on, let's see what this. Hold on, is this. Bob, are you gonna sing this time? No. Okay. <laughs> it's a refrain. Uh, All right, ready? Wait, 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 hold on, hold on, ready? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Everybody you together. fucked up the lyrics. Come on. Immediately. I'm going to get you in five. Too many syllables. Four. Not too many five. syllables. Three. Too many. Two. Oh, no. One. Just like the ones in 2006. You fucking too many syllables. God damn it, you do this every year. Vision and knockouts wrestling. They pushed guys like AJ and Drew. I'm <laughs> dreaming of we a well right booked impact. <laughs> Come on, guys. Without a Hogan on my screen. Yeah, I see it's getting better. Yeah. There's no monologuing by Jeff. No, you go high enough. Oh, okay. <laughs> Allow good wrestlers to fight. Do we just start over on this part? No. <laughs> I'm dreaming of a well booked impact. Just, Just like the ones in 2006 With the next visions and jokes <laughs> All frolicking in the snow <laughs> <laughs> All right, there you go there you go. I don't know. You know we, we get more successful uh, successful with these every fuck. year, right? I should have said seven years, and we finally are getting the hang of this. I should have said, and their matches steal the show. <laughs> Shit, that would have made sense. Fuck ass. Who's beeping? <laughs> Who's beeping? It's all night. Nothing. All oh. night. <laughs> Uh, wow. Shit, balls. So. What's next? Predictions? Yeah, I think so. Do it. <laughs> well, yeah, first of all, the Mayhem left. Christmas, too. Jesus Christ, we didn't talk about the best thing that happened all week. What was the best thing that happened all week? <laughs> Cody Rhodes has a must. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> okay, here's Tell a question for you. I got. He has a I got a question for you. Okay. Hard time. Cody Rhodes and his pencil thin mustache. Okay. Pencil thin. Magnum TA. Oh, oh, there's no comparison. No, no. There's I, no comparison. I just no. Magnum TA on that. is all that is man. All right. All that Cody is man. Cody Rhodes is all that is mustache. <laughs> Good point. Okay. Cody Rhodes Boom. is all that is creepy pedophile. Kind of honest, but it's okay. They haven't done that gimmick before. Nope. <laughs> no, they haven't. <laughs> At least not for seven years that we remember. <laughs> Seven years to limit your limitations. LB. Up on that one. LB. Oh my god. <laughs> what? Sorg. Tell me. Sorg, what's gonna happen? What do you think is gonna happen? In 2013, in the world of professional wrestling, uh, more particularly WWE. Okay, alright. So, there's crazy prediction and there's a more reasonable prediction. Okay. The crazy prediction. Is that I think, I honestly think, something is going to happen with Vince McMahon's health. 
whether it be a stroke or a heart attack. Did you see ah. his face after the Linda fail? Exactly. He was, <laughs> he was like, I'm going to die tonight. That was the look <laughs> on his face. Is something something is legitimately going to happen with him, and I don't know exactly how it's going to affect things, whether he'll finally hang it up, whether he'll retire, whether he'll say, fuck, get these wires out of me! <laughs> or what? Little explosion? Yeah, exactly. Austin hits him in the head of a bed. Uh, what would be yeah. horrible if he actually died in a limo explosion? Awful. Yeah. Oh, awful. I'd, awful. I'd feel bad like the, the karma thing. People would talk about that for <laughs> decades because he faked it first. Yeah. Um, I don't have any joke for that. Uh, <laughs> uh, and uh, what did I say? Was that the outlandish prediction? I don't remember. Yeah, I, don't know. Was I think that's no, more. No, I think that's more outlandish. Yeah, a that's safer outlandish. prediction is that we will see two, two John Cena uh, WWE Championship runs and one Triple H Championship run. What? At least Ooh. one more. Ooh, Interesting. Wow. Get him out of that 13 territory, right? Mm-hmm. Right. Why, why are you pointing at me, Swift? There's Chris? Two, gonna be two. Uh, oh, no. Why are you pointing at me, Swift? There is. Am I supposed to say something? I'd like now? to. I'd like to point out to the viewers at home that, like, at the beginning of the night when I would stroke Riz's hair gently, now I'm used he to freaked it. out real bad, and then I told him to get used to it, and it was gonna get worse, and now he has. <laughs> Riz, is on, Riz is on board. Shh, shh, shh. It's okay. It's okay. 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 <laughs> what do you want me to do, Swift? I want you to give me a prediction. All right. <laughs> God, they're all. I'm trying to give you an inaudible cue. That's well, what the point is. I don't want it says, "Hey, fucker, no. you're next." <laughs> Do it, Riz. Or I'll all choke right. you with my tie again. That wasn't your tie. What was that? Last year. Didn't I do that? I think I threatened it last year. Did I, I thought you. I think you're thinking of Daniel Bryan. Yeah, I'll, okay. I'll, I'll go Daniel Bryan on now, you. I'll grow, I'll grow a big beard, and then I'll yes. check you with a tie. Yeah, good point. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll yeah. charge you yeah. for it. And then Lunchbox will make a run of the indies, and then come back. <laughs> <laughs> I like how WrestleFan only interrupts when I'm trying to. You know, <laughs> well, because you're not my, saying anything, you know. No, um, but for me, my predictions. <laughs> oh, you don't pick up on inaudible cues, Riz. <laughs> inaudible cues. <laughs> inaudible cues. There's that's, an inaudible. Uh, that's the it. title of the podcast. Inaudible, <laughs> inaudible, inaudible cues. cues. Inaudible <laughs> cues. Right. Uh, my prediction, finally. Um, let's see. Nope. The great Kali will win. <laughs> Everything. Win what? But everything. <laughs> everything. And then everything. retire. Are you touting? And then, re- <laughs> and then retire. I am now. <laughs> and then retire before everybody else as champion. And I will win the whatever we were doing. The retirement pool. Pretty- oh, yeah. Say? Yeah, we... I- uh, Shireman and Wheels, I got questions for you. After <laughs> time. Uh, but in the meantime, okay, uh, Shireman, yeah. predictions for 2000 and next. I would like to uh, make a few predictions here, if I may. Wow, Lay uh, gentlemen, I've prepared a statement. Um, <laughs> a couple things here, uh, and some of this is poached from people who are smarter than me. So, um, <laughs> uh, a couple things here, I, I think. WWE elev- either elevates a, a real star or brings a star in from TNA, and and this won't be popular, but it, it might be Jeff Hardy. I don't know. Um, they're in desperate need of, of top end help here, um, and, and he could probably come in and give them a couple of months, whether it's with Punk or, or whoever. You know what I mean? Um, so I think that'll happen. Uh, what I the the more bold prediction I'd like to make is I believe that they unify the world titles this year. <laughs> I'd like to see that. Unified Seriously, yeah, I think it's yeah. fucking yeah. ridiculous. I feel like they're, they I feel like they're teasing the uh, USIC belts, right? With, with Say that all, again. I feel like they're teasing the US, the US and the IC belts. Mm-hmm. They're definitely. Technically, um, if and Kofi I think won the, the match, big mistake the titles they, would have been unified. Yeah, yeah, they don't. They don't have anything. They don't have anybody up top. They're they're very thin up top, and they have this huge mid card, mid to low card, and, and that's where those two titles reside. So why would you unify those? Even the, you know, even though they they do seem like they're teasing it, it, it makes more sense to me to unify the top title and stop pissing around with that bullshit and 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 get those top guys together. You know, to sort of you know galvanize that that top tier 
a little bit. So I, I, that's something I would like to see happen. I don't know if they're smart enough to take my advice, but um, a, a cup, two, two more quick things here. Undertaker retires. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know, I know that's like, you know, uh, newsflash, the, the sky is blue, but for Who Christ's sake, we'll the, guy can, the guy can barely wrestle once a year. Just mm-hmm. hang it up, man. Who do you mm-hmm. think will put him out? Do you, or do you think no, anyone think will put him out? That leads me into my final prediction, as a matter of fact. Hey, um, see what I did there? Um, <laughs> Almost like you planned that. Jesus, I know. Tell me about it. Uh, <laughs> also, and I, I just I, I just heard this. He actually has started his entrance to WrestleMania. <laughs> you know, he's making his way to the ring right now. Job over in Jersey. Now I know why. That makes so much sense. Uh, so AJ is taking an epic piss break. <laughs> what I would maybe love... that's why Chachi's not in. He's already on the can. <laughs> I, I what I would like to see happen here. I, and this is completely poached from somebody here on the interwebs, but I would like to see Punk end it at, at WrestleMania here. Um, I saw something floated, and this is uh, there's a guy named Seth Mates who's, who was a, a guy who uh, was in WWE creative during the Attitude Era 10, 15 years ago, something like that. And now he's just some blowhard asshole on Twitter. But I do. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, is that your professional you an idea here that you could have if you want to put Punk over as a legend, like to go from a guy who's on a, a legendary run to a true titan. You have him go out there. You have him beat Rock at the Royal Rumble. You have him beat Taker at WrestleMania. You have him beat Triple H at SummerSlam, and he has effectively ended the Attitude Era. He went out and beat three monsters. In a oh, row, then, boom, then boom, it would boom. have to lead to thirty, where he beats Austin. He yeah, he would have to have a, a cap of Austin. That would be amazing. It, it would be, it would be one of the great ideas and the great runs, maybe in the history of the sport. Which, of course, will never happen because they fucking, <laughs> it's, you know, they're idiots. Um, <laughs> you know, it could could you have him keep the title that long? I mean, you're talking about him holding that title for what two and a half years at that point? Holy shit! Mm-hmm. I, I mean, that would be unreal but you know if you line those guys up if the, you know are, are those guys willing to, to do the job for him i have no idea you know at some point taker's gonna have to lose you know yeah. uh, all the legends have, have lost their last match here and, and you know walked away no worse for the wear hey it's gonna have to happen i think Edge. um Edge. so i would love to see something like that happen in, in 2013 you know i'll go so far as to make that prediction even though it'll never happen but uh, <laughs> i like that unified world the world title thing actually is, is my one legitimate prediction for this year so fantastic wrestle hey. fan <laughs> this guy I predict that I'm going to talk about indie wrestling and everyone's going to hate me for it. Uh, um, no, up. I'm kidding. Sound <laughs> predi- True. Moving on. <laughs> Moving on, man, Mike. Uh, no. no, 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 no. Hold on. Uh, but, yeah, my prediction, uh, I have two. Uh, early in 2012, uh, most likely early, but it will be any time in 2012, Brock Lesnar will win. We are in 2013. 2013. Wait, where is it? You can learn your numbers. You go to college. <laughs> and Jim confusing. Read um, a book. So, drink some, more cough syrup. Yeah. No, no. no. Drink the cough syrup. <laughs> It'll Peer fuck up pressure. your baby kidneys. <laughs> yeah, a baby kidneys. Sometime <laughs> baby. Into, I'm sometime a chemist. In, I say it's okay. No. <laughs> Don't listen to him. He's from New York. <laughs> <laughs> Do it. Do it, my little puppet. Dance for me. Wrestle fan answer. Sometime quickly in, two, in 2013, faster most likely, than this, most likely in the beginning of the year, Brock Lesnar will win a championship. <laughs> oh, I can see that. Uh, Bang, and no. and the second, we have currently what four television programs for WWE that are on some form of like television. Yeah, there's Raw and NXT, and then there's yeah. uh, no, not, no, not NXT. Night, Slam, there's Raw, five, there's Raw, six, Raw, and there's uh, Raw, 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 SmackDown, Main Event, and Main Slam. Event. I forgot about Main Event. Raw, so six. Raw SmackDown, uh, Main Event, and uh, Slam. Uh, Superstars. Slam. Superstars, that's seven. Uh, uh, there's Ignition, <laughs> Ignition, Ignition, which is eight. Livewire. Live 
Um, uh, Saturday. Shotgun Saturday night. Oh, Broad Saturday time night. wrestling. What's cracking? Uh, Tuesday Tuesday night Thunder. Titans. What's cracking? Thunder. That's, Thunder. That's at Are least, you serious? That's 17. <laughs> um, Impact. 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 Oh, God. I forgot about Impact. Uh, Impact. Long Island and IC. IT. What? Long Island and IC. I, that's what Torx said. <laughs> IWC <laughs> Ignition. <laughs> IWC Ignition. <laughs> AOM Bank, Bank, Bank rolled by Damien Sandow. Uh, I'll do a prediction. RWA wrap up. Oh, God. Uh, what, AOM uh, rundown. What are we doing? Um, <laughs> All American Wrestling. Show. All American Wrestling. I remember that is uh, AWA. AWA. Oh, Sunday Texas Night Slam. Saturday uh, Night Slam event. Sunday morning slam. Sunday morning slam. Sunday 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 oh, WMAC <laughs> Masters. Uh, Kaiju Big Battle. Kaiju Big Battle. American Gladiators. $5 wrestling. Um, God Chikara. damn, they have a lot of fucking shows. I know, they, they, they own a lot. <laughs> Jesus, Vince McMahon. Vince McMahon. Holy shit, dude. He's trying to start a network or something. That was good. Bottom That's line, they're gonna add another one. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, it's just, it's just footage from every um, every show ever made. No, no, it's every what uh, are those things where they put the camera up your asshole? <laughs> <laughs> colonoscopy from every colonoscopy Vince McMahon's ever had. I hope that you have video and can see what I'm doing with my finger to gesture colonoscopy. He, he, is, he is inching it up the butt. will put in there. Yeah, it's horrible. Inside. I like how you. I like how the worm it started. The you started like this, <laughs> then it gradually turned in the whole arm. Haven't you ever had a colonoscopy? No. <laughs> I tried to block out that memory from college. <laughs> I don't even think he was a doctor. Mad Mike. <laughs> I paid him in chili mac and cheese. Mad Mike. <laughs> Yo. Wait, wait. All right. No, um, predictions. Okay, predictions. Um, I, I have one safe prediction that Bully Ray will be the TNA champion. <laughs> Um, broke sword. and one, <laughs> don't know what's oh, going God. on. One crazy like prediction again. the kings of wrestling will wrestle each other on TV. Ooh. Ooh. Everyone's excited and made the, the ooh noise. <laughs> I got an indie boner. <laughs> indie boner noise. Wrestle fan got a huge Wrestle one. fan's touching himself immediately. Yeah. <laughs> ah. I want immediately. I want a clip of that down. noise. So every time I get a text, it's Wrestle Fan going. <laughs> oh, it's the uh, breaking noise. Taker will not be at WrestleMania this year. Who? Taker will not wrestle at WrestleMania this year. I can Good. see that. I can see that. Did you boss, I think you missed Eric you to go. <laughs> what? Like, Sorg was pointing at you. What? I already did one. I still you did one. point. Oh, you, when you pointed Wrestle. at SpongeBob. Friends, you yeah. don't know silent cues. Well, you know what? There's two different silent cues going on at the exact same time. I don't know shit. You know well, what the key of silent <laughs> cues is? Silence, and we're talking about it. Shut up, Russell <laughs> fan. Shut up, Russell no fan. We're happening. Listen. Okay, okay. Hangout. Google Hangout. All right, hangout. All right. All right Google, Google Hangout. Bring up that Hangout so I can Bobby. point people. No, not yes, Bobby. Oh, we're what? starting it. We're going down the line. Alexander Cars. All right. <laughs> All right. You've had like an hour to prepare for this. 2013. Colt Cabana nice. begins his run as WWE champion. What? It starts when what? he wins the Royal Rumble. What? What? Okay. No, it's too quiet. All right. Do you have what? a regular prediction? <laughs> <laughs> Is that your That's safe one? That's the outlandish one. That's the safe one. That's the safe That's one. Safe. The outlandish one is an alien fucks Vince McMahon in the asshole. <laughs> controls him digitally with his barbed penis. <laughs> and convinces him to just show reruns of the Golden Girls instead of wrestling. <laughs> my, my safe prediction is that oh, it's going to be CM Punk you. versus Russ, uh, versus Undertaker at WrestleMania. Streak versus respect. <sighs> I like it. I like it. I'm a fan. Uh, Zero, Zero 2K. I have two. I'm going to say the first one is WWE will find another show for Tuesday and have a monopoly of wrestling every day. And we're going to have to move. <laughs> no, we're not. <laughs> Fuck! We're not moving we can shit. with whatever they rerun on Tuesday. And the other one is Jerry Lawler will have another stroke. 
Wow. Oh, oh, too soon. Oh. Too soon. We did say Vince McMahon was going to blow up in a limo, though. So. Bobby! 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 Right. Bobby, it's your Bobby. turn now. I got two. All right, Bobby! Bobby! You know, you know, you know My safe prediction I am is no, Wade no, Barrett's going to yeah, win a world title this year. You know what's sad year. is we didn't fucking see Puppet FJ Town. Yeah. It's yeah, the Bobby. Christmas special, and you I'm didn't prep the puppet? Get the puppet! I don't know what no part of your tight ass country club, you freak, man. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> what is this a Sanford and Son? <laughs> 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 Five ass turkeys. <laughs> Can, can, I, wow. can I make my predictions? Yeah, sure. Yeah, go, Bobby. Go. No. go, Bobby. Wade Barrett's going to win the world title this year. That's my that's my safe prediction. The other prediction, Stone Cold versus CM Punk at WrestleMania. Ooh, Ooh. I want that one to be true, Bobby, because I'm going to WrestleMania. I, I want to love that. that. And with that note, I'll be back. <laughs> oh, snap. Where is it going? Wheels. Wheels predictions. All right, predictions. Safe one. Uh, let's see. They finally debuted a new WWE title, and it's still better looking than Jeff Hardy's ugly ass belts. Ha! Ah, that's a fair assessment. Yep. That's a given. Uh, By the way, it's 12 12 and, and 12 12 and 12 12 to 12. Oh my 12, god. 12 12 12 12. <laughs> Holy 12, 12, shit, 12, it 12, is. 12, 12. Okay, go ahead. Wow, it is. Uh, the next, my <clears throat> truly, I think they'll still keep the stupid world title. Debuted a new belt, and Jeff Hardy will be back in WWE. Ugh, that's gross, I but I think it's I think possible. It's Third uh, dimension, Sorg. What's your prediction, sir? My prediction is a reunion of the Spirit Squad. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Third wow. prediction, or third, third dimension sword going out on a limb. Excellent. Ferret Squad! <laughs> Ferret Squad. Ferret Squad! Are they going to use Sin Cara's trampoline? No. Nope. They bring oh, their own me. trampoline to the show, sir. They won't all fit on there. Puppet FJ Town. One at a time. Puppet FJ Town's Pup, there? Puppet FJ yeah, Town. Puppet FJ Town, do you have predictions? My prediction is Razor Friend wants to tie his shoes. I <laughs> 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 oh, oh, love Puppet FJ Town. <laughs> he brings me joy in my loins. See, it was condescending, <laughs> but I can't help laughing. Because <laughs> it's a <laughs> but it's, okay, it's okay, we'll just get you Velcro. I don't understand what's going on. Oh. Folks, this has been incredible. Do you want to wrap up with that? No, no, no. let's close no, out with no, the 12 no, no. Days of Mayhem no, Christmas. I'm asking, I'm asking yeah. Sorg a question. <laughs> All right. We're going to – this has been this has been wonderful. I want to I wanna personally thank – I want to thank all of you guys, uh, all of you that's been on the show this week, and I want to thank everyone listening at home. It has been uh, – I, I, I know I'm speaking for everyone. Uh, it has been our distinct pleasure to bring you wrestling entertainment – uh, each and every Tuesday this year in one form or another. Thank you so much for listening. I'm pretty sure we're taking the rest of the year off. Is that right, Sorg? There will be no mayhem. Uh, go and listen to the back catalog because there's some fucking gems back there. You Listen to last me. year's Christmas episode because holy crap, I was rolling. Uh, it was ridiculous. It was fucking also, insane. Find, the, find Just, the anniversary show. Anniversary show. Just Whoa. fucking go and find it. Folks, Whoa. Merry Christmas. Happy Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, and every other holiday that you celebrate. Thank you That's so much for joining us. I love Christmas. you, baby Jesus. Thank you. <laughs> Charmin loves baby Jesus. Charmin. He oh, loves Jesus. the baby Jesus. But, but he's not us. in love with the Jesus. baby Jesus. That'd be weird. Have a very happy holidays. Have a very happy rest of your year and a happy new year. And we will see you in 2012. We leave you. 13. 2013, time, time is a loop. Time's a loop. I have a TARDIS. TARDIS uh, loop. Can't stop the shit. We will leave you this week and the year of 2012 with a very special 
song. Oh, Sorg. Yeah. Sorg! Oh, Hit the music! Days of Christmas. You got it up on your email I there, sir? It. It's right here. All right, let's go. Yeah. Are we each doing, wait, hold on. Are we each doing, like, segments know, of it? or just doing the whole thing. Uh, all of it. We're all Dude. singing together. We're a fucking Wrestling Mayhem family, Wrestle fan, and you're yeah. our weird yeah. son. <laughs> yeah, get it. You're our weird way. son who locks himself yeah. in the room, and we know what you're doing, but we're not going to point <laughs> it out because we want you to grow up not fucked up. Yeah, we're jerking off to so New Japan for a Lunchbox, give friends a big old hug and let's sing this 12 Days of Christmas. Come on. Yay! 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 Get it on camera! Get it on Get camera! Get it on camera! Sorry! Get it on camera! Sort. 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 There we go. Yay. Christmas hug. <laughs> Do the brilliant divine. Bam. <laughs> I heard the slap Christmas before it happened. Christmas Christmas gave to me an email from Big PC. On the second day of Christmas, the mayhem gave to me two new shirts and an email from Big PC. On the third day of Christmas, <laughs> three judgy walkouts, two suit shirts, and an email from Big BBC. I, I, I. And the fourth day is Christmas, and we have gave to me four ghosts, three judgy walkouts, two suit shirts, and an email from Big BBC. On the fifth day of Christmas, the mayhem gave to me Fuck TNA! Bobby, are you singing? Host three just to walk out two new shirts and an email from Big TVC. On the sixth day of mayhem, my mayhem gave to me Six and he wins TNA! Four co-hosts, three chachi walkouts, two dudes, and a big old big doobie seat. Hey. On the second day of Christmas, the mayhem gave to me seven buffalo riders, six in minutes. Fuck TNA. Four co-hosts, three chachi walkouts, and a big from Big TVC. On the eighth day of Christmas, some may help gave to me. And a diggity voice with seven buffalo riders, six indie minutes, fuck TNA! Four go hosts, three judges, walk up two new shirts, and an email from Big PBC. On the ninth day of Christmas, they have gave to me nine self promotions, no ability, voicemail, seven to my four riders, six in the minutes, four TNA. Four co hosts, three touchy walk out, two new shirts, and an email from Big PPC. On the tenth day of Christmas, they have gave to me ten blowjob off. What? Oh, the boys have seven to the right of six in the minutes. Four TNA. Four co hosts, two new shirts. What? what? <laughs> and a ten big PPC. On the eleventh day of Christmas, they have gave to me. 11 member wins, 10 full job offers, 9 self promoters, 7 fight and horsemail, 7 and a fight of 6 and a fight of 6 and a fight 3 chachi walkouts, 2 new shirts, and an email from Big PPC. Our ninth day of Christmas, the mayhem game. Last one. Twelve Google Hangouts. Seven Remember Wins. Ten Blowjob Offers. Nine Self Promoters. Seven Voting. Wait up. Seven Buffalo Riders. Six Mini Minutes. Five DNA. Four Coast. Three Chessy Walk Up. Two New Shirts. And an email from Big PPC. Ah, oh, Mary. Hey. <laughs>
<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's the mayhem. Thank you very so much. Thank you, DJ Holy Lunchbox, shit. for drunken co hosting and the high fives, and Riz for sticking shit to your face. Mad Mike from the box, <laughs> all light up. Phone. Don't fucking electrocute yourself. Sherman is the Rob Ross Sherman. of the mayhem show. Wrestle Rest fans the fan in there, do his Rob shit. Ross. And everybody, including the damn puppet in the puppet hangout. FJ thank you very puppet much. Man. This has been your oh, mayhem representation for 2012 we'll see you in 2013 seven years down fuck the rest we'll see you next year mayhem out just wait just wait just wait just wait